so we're live. Hello, everyone. Can Hi, you everybody. hear us? Can you hear us? We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, it's been a while. Hi, y'all. Hi, hi, everybody. It is Sunday, August 23rd. You turned us up? I turned us up? I turned this. Oh. You have to bear with us. We, we, <laughs> we haven't done this for a while, and we've got a little bit of a different setup than we had before. So some things might be a little different. So it, we might have a bit of having to rearrange some things, How's too. Working now? We'll see. I don't know if anybody can even hear me or if I'm live, but... Okay, Brandon says it's good. He's kind oh. of listening in oh, okay. on the crowd. So. Yeah, um, we've got Brandon, our assistant. Um, some of you guys know him from DragonCon and Pop Gallery and stuff. He's with us here. Um, he's our tech guy now. Um, we've got Matt, of course. You all know Matty. And I am Jasmine. And Hello. we are live here from Celebration Florida, quarantine edition. Thanks for uh, all the... <laughs> People who used to follow us, well, gosh, it's been like what, <laughs> eight, months, eight months, I think. Eight yeah, months, nine months. It, it, and, yeah, uh, and thank you so the, much has happened. All the new people, yes, yeah, thank you to all of you new people. So it's, also, it's been a strange year for everyone, but we're it, it's been a strange year for a lot of us, yeah. We're good, so uh, yeah, we are yeah, good. Thanks, everyone. Um, also, you notice that the exclamation raffle uh, is the same, but the uh. Oh yeah, we give prizes out. Right. And but the, the um, code is the same: exclamation point raffle, yeah, all one the word. Delivery system's different. But yeah, there's stuff will be a little bit different. We've got we don't have Mubot, we have Cloudbot. Cloudbot also Cloudbot. Mubot's, in Mubot's in there. Oh, Mubot's in there too. Oh, okay. I thought I thought Mubot like turned into Cloud. Right. Uh, Mubot is my administrator. <laughs> Mubot uh, okay. Mubot is more a behind the scenes person now. Person. They've got a side gig going on, so okay. they can't be full time. Yeah. You know, everybody does. <laughs> so today, Jasmine is painting uh, a painting for the Corey Helford the Gallery Corey Helford show. Gallery show, which and that's uh, at the end of February. Yes, at the end of February of, of February. next year, twenty twenty one. So it's this painting won't be one that you'll see for a while, but um, you're getting to watch me while I paint it. The Corey Helfer Gallery is in downtown Los Angeles, California. So that is my show, Enigma, will be opening. And I will be there in person with a whole bunch of paintings. So that should be fun. It'll be open to the public. It'll be free. It'll be hanging up there for, I think, they're planning on six weeks. There a lot of a lot of gallery stuff and shows and everything are it's just kind of in flux at the moment obviously because of uh covid virus stuff so if if dates change we will let you know right i mean i think we're kind of used to that <laughs> yeah i think everybody's sort of used, of used to, yeah in case anybody didn't hear the kansas city renaissance festival has been canceled as has um dragon con so we we will not be at those no we won't and neither uh, will you guys so right right uh, we don't have any um i believe Besides the Corey Helfer uh, show, we don't really have anything scheduled as far as shows, correct? Adam? We do not have anything specifically scheduled. I know I will be doing events for Disney, um, both here in Florida and in California, but I don't know for sure when yet. Well, I guess for sure I will be at Epcot in January and February for the Epcot International Festival of the Arts. That's a long time from now, too. All this stuff we're talking about is not till January, or February. So hopefully it's far enough along that everything will settle okay, so down. Everybody be healthy. They can't hear me. Oh shoot! Can you hear me? Karen? I can hear you, but I'm sort of in the same room as you. You're saying they can't hear me. Uh oh. Can't hear Matt. Can you hear me? Can you hear Matt, everybody? Okay. I. Okay. Hopefully people are hearing me. I'm... I don't know. Are there people in the chat room? Someone says I sound far away. Mm. Um, They're in Florida. What, what it is, is uh, the rings are uh, picking it up through different headphones. Mm. Let me yeah. see if I can. Okay. Bear with us, folks. We're working on our audio. Well, it should be picking up through this. Okay, someone said they can hear me from England. Oh, wow. That's pretty good. <laughs> Jasmine's mic's up too high, says somebody. Oh, why is that? Am I too noisy? There, 
I turned it down a little bit. Okay. Okay, is that better? For those of you who don't know the format, I myself can't We will not be doing the Dragon Con on <laughs> online virtual event thing. I'm not exactly sure what the Dragon Con online virtual event thing is. Okay. I, I don't think I'm doing it. I'll probably be here. Everyone's telling us different things. Okay. Ah. Can everybody see me? Or see my painting, at least. That's the important part. I hope. Okay, Brandon's going to look at something on the uh, little yeah, thing. And again, folks, we'll, we'll be here for hours. So. <laughs> Hopefully we won't be now, turning on and off too much. But we'll see. I thought audio was perfect when stream first started. Yeah. I did too, and then people started saying, "Yeah, turn it up, turn it down. I'm gonna turn Jasmine's back where I had it. Yeah, I think it's playing um, my, my mic. Because it's oh. separate mics. Yeah. Oh, like if it's stereo. Oh yeah, well. So um, going through. Oh. That's this is what we got going on. <laughs> Can we broadcast in mono? I don't know how to do that. Okay. Okay. Oh. People are a lot of people are saying they hear us both perfect. Yeah, it's probably folks. Um, it's probably you. You uh, have stereo on. And people it's are saying broadcast. background music. Brandon, if we can turn that down. I can't. I don't see a sort of thing. It just looks like I'm staring into the distance. I don't know if you can hear me, so I won't talk too much. I think people can hear you, Jasmine. Oh, okay. And. Another person says that now people are saying they're both good. Oh, okay. Someone said they love the background picture. Oh, thank you. Now people are both saying both are good. So you can hear both of us. Apparently the problem was the music. Oh, that's okay. We could... Um, Did you... How, <laughs> how loud is the music now? <clears throat> 20%? Okay. All right, that's okay. fine. Music's just for ambiance anyway. Yeah, it's kind of for everything's quiet and we don't want it to be silent, sort of. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Oh, um, we have a better mics. I, the one thing that I that we got last time uh, when we used to broadcast is we got a lot of uh, echo. Mm-hmm. And I, that's what I'm hoping we don't get is echo. Oh, yeah. So anyway, yes, exclamation raffle if you want to join the yeah, we'll have a bunch raffle of, in bunch about an hour. today. And that the prize for the first prize is a print. Cool. And uh, that's, oh, should I be showing? <laughs> yeah, if you like. Okay. It's a Sonera. Okay, and she's she's our print of the week. She is our print yeah. of the week, also. Yes. So I actually have the print here. Oh, and we can sign her too, right? Or Absolutely. I, can, I will sign her rather. Yes. If this one, this if like this one gets dark. paint or something on it, I'll have you sign a new one. Yeah, I, I can. I promise. Yeah, I might yeah. have painty fingers, but she is pretty. Okay. She's also. Uh, she's very pretty. Yeah, I'll put a link up because um Yeah, because we have if you don't win right. one, we have Besides, so she's but on um actually since she's a print of the week. And she's got my kitty tiger. Right, she's yeah. also on sale. Yeah, yeah. They're on sale this week, eleven dollars and ninety nine cents. And we right. always ship anywhere in the world. And I believe uh some of the other uh formats are also on sale. Yeah, they've got like canvases that are um the open edition canvases. oh hi bianca hey bianca oh she said it would make it authentic yes so very true gosh i haven't seen anybody in so long this is this is so funny um it's it's literally just been matt and then i've just seen brandon like last night yeah basically i've just seen jasmine and then i've seen brandon the last couple months yeah I, I, and then i see people at the grocery store I don't really much. I've been stuck inside, so it's like I see, but saw a bunch of doctors, but they don't count. Other than that, just been Matt. <laughs> Haven't been able to go up to Kansas City or anything. So one thing that, um, and I'll probably mention this a couple times uh, during broadcast today, uh, is you see the little slideshow on your screen, guys. Um, I was thinking it might be kind of fun if you had uh, photos from conventions that you've taken with jasmine or maybe your uh art display with jasmine's art or your pin sets or something like that we'd like to make it a little bit more um fan based in that regard or at least have a um we basically play the uh slideshow out of a folder 
I, I don't want to give too much background <laughs> info, but Show how the obviously made. it's um. So I was thinking if you sent some photos uh, to Matt at Strangeling dot com, and I'll put that in chat in a minute, that that might be kind of cool. Yeah. So um, it would also you would feel like you were part more part of the the broadcast, and you could say, hey, that's you know that's my yeah uh, picture. Yeah, because sometimes we and sometimes we know you guys like from shows and things, but we. We don't know that you're you here up at Twitch, so it's kind of cool for us to see that type of thing. So I'll type Matt at strangeling.com in there. And if you'd like to send uh, a photo, uh, that would be awesome. Also, we're thinking about integrating some uh, some camera feed yeah. uh, that's not directly a live broadcast, like we've pre-recorded things. This would be a lot better when cons happen again <laughs> yeah, um, we're we thinking about maybe getting some film stuff and, some yeah. footage of, of you guys and um of, with jasmine or you know just all that sort of thing to try to make this more of a a fan based channel yeah so in the whole time we can chat and be social we can enjoy jasmine painting and turn down the music if we have to <laughs> So, um, if you guys think that's a good idea, uh, that'd be great. Also, any thoughts uh, on improving this channel? Um, we can't promise that we'd implement those things, but we're welcome to listen to anything. Yeah. So, but thank you. We're at 126 viewers, Jasmine. Oh, for heaven's sake. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Thank you, everybody. Oh, someone says it, it helps their anxiety that we're on Twitch. Oh. Well, thank you. It, thank it, you it increases much. mine a little. That's incredibly sweet. Oh. <laughs> no, but honestly, uh, it's it's no, nice to be that's, back. That's lovely. Yeah, it's very good to be back. I was very ill for the past half year or a year or so, so it's nice to be feeling better and being back able to oh, work. You're good. And sit up all day. Every now and then you guys might hear me chatting off to my side. I'm just chatting with Brandon. <laughs> um, he's kind of uh, babys- trying to babysit the stream. <laughs> uh, in a perfect world, he'll do this uh, remotely. Yeah, uh, yeah. So we're, but we're the first time we need help. Yeah. Yeah. We have a different camera on Jasmine's art. Yeah. Which I can tell already, that. Jasmine. Yeah. I think that the quality coming through uh-huh. looks better. Oh, on the on the painting um, itself. Absolutely. Oh, good. And it does have a. I don't know if Jasmine would want to do it in the future, but it does have a zoom oh. feature. So I. Cool. <laughs> if you, where is it? It, it's is it this part or is it this no part? uh i think you would be able to see it it kind of looks like a should i look at <laughs> let's see looks like a what it looks like a little silver button and it would be near your uh your left hand now oh okay and it's on the machine itself i think you can zoom in and out oh, no, that's a... this painting is a 16 by 20 it is Oh, wait. It did something. Okay. No, it went away. Oh, wait. Is it still there? Okay. Uh, it says <laughs> draw... Mem- okay, just... you. Yeah, I think you hit the record button. Oh, should I? Okay. Here, I'll... Okay. I'm very sorry. That's the only silver button I saw that was on that side. I think it's a silver... It's... This... Oh, that black thing? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I, I didn't know it was black. Oh, no, that's fine. So oh, I, I see. Hey, hey, hey. Forth, yeah, let me see. Um... Oh. The, the thing is, you don't see yourself live. No, I don't. So it's going to but... do something in a minute on here. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. I don't even know where it zoomed in. Wait, have I looked into the viewfinder with you, that? Yes. Yeah? Okay. You can tell from the viewfinder. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. So you can uh, focus in on details. That's good. Oh, wait. No, I, no, we're good. Yeah, it was just a power thing. Yeah. Power yeah. Oh, that's, that's really good. So, yeah, if you start working that little ball around, yeah. it's not hard to adjust. Um, yeah. We can play with that later. But, yeah, pretty nifty, huh? That is fab. Okay. Let's see. So, I'm well, well, uh, happy you uh, love the new camera. Well, I haven't even Oh, that's cool, Jeff. It actually lo- looks pretty neat on the, on the stream. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, this is, we're figuring out a lot of this. Stuff while we're going, yeah, so. it's it's so weird. A lot of this you have to kind of figure out live. It's true. Oh. <laughs> okay. So, did I zoom? So in Brandon on the is in yeah, is in chat, and um, okay. Brandon, can you say hi in chat so people see your little sword and know so that they you're know a that you're a moderator. Moderator. <laughs> and a lot of you met there. There he is a lot uh-huh. of you met Brandon at. 
the last Dragon Con. Yeah. So, gosh, about a year ago. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, and I remember driving That's back so with a... I remember... Jasmine, do you remember having to leave early? We're terrified that that early the, the hurricane, hurricane that never happened. Was coming. Oh, gosh, now that two was hurricanes terrifying. are now, yeah, coming I, or you something. I don't know. Tell me about that, but then like got bored or something. Matt, you said there's two hurricanes coming. There are. Okay. I don't think they're going to hit Central Florida. I think they're going to slam into like the Mississippi area. Oh man, poor Mississippi. Um, I think both of them are. Yeah. So that's kind of scary it is marco and laura yeah they're a couple i guess uh, yeah marco together? and laura if anybody knows a, a a couple, couple named marco, marco and, laura, and just, laura just slap them yeah. just slap them right in the face yeah or Brian's oh it's them. coming up to atlanta okay oh atlanta. gosh i, oh, shoot. I don't know. we were literally talking about the hurricane on our way back from atlanta just oh now. but they're they're headed to louisiana but i assume that the rain and fallout and just you know as it keeps going no, don't hit Louisiana. Oh, Louisiana. My sister's name is Laura. Yeah. Uh-uh. Name Laura's is the, Laura, but it's a, the German gonna, way. Like, uh, oh, somebody's joining the party. Who's this? Um, that could be a delivery, sweetie. I'm gonna just peek out the window. See if they have a mask. Oh yeah, it was a it's a delivery. Oh, okay. Um, I'll worry about it later. Okay. It's nice and dry out there right now. That's good. Kinda. Kinda. It's been raining a lot here. It has been raining. We're in Celebration, Florida, so we're like right outside Disney. For those of you who don't know. So um, I do. Can I um, can I show off a couple things just because it's fun? You can show off whatever you want. Okay. Baby. Can I? You wanna do hold I sunshine? Say, do I just keep painting, right? Would well, you wanna show sunshine on camera? Sure. Okay, and then I'll press she, my little button. She, yes, yes. Yes. Your sunshine so, button. <laughs> Brandon and I. This, uh, I have not done any of this. This no, is these guys. We so. actually just started showing this to Jasmine. Uh, uh, yeah, I didn't know. About... Oh, come here. Come here, little baby. Where's my baby? Come she's, she's in her little hole and she doesn't. Come on. She doesn't want to be on TV, does she? Get out of there. Get out of your little hobby. <laughs> Come here, baby. Yeah. Well, it's a cute little bed hole. It's one of those fabrics. All right. Where's my baby? Ah. Oh, a oh, hair in my mouth. Oh, Ew. my gosh. Okay. Ah. Come on, Diane. Okay, there you go, baby. Oh, your sunshine. Look, all the kitties are doing great. We still have our three usual kitties. We got sunshine. Ah! Sunshine. <laughs> and sunshine, yes, baby. <laughs> yes. So we've How'd got little Dine. Aw, but she's been good. So I have little funny buttons and yeah. stuff now. You gonna go behind me, baby, or are you going away? You so, go? uh, okay. I I I took the photo and Brandon uh, designed a little thing around it. <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna make more things like that. If you guys have any fun ideas for mm-hmm. that, I have a few more um, that I'll show throughout the broadcast. <laughs> Could have some so, painting related ones. Huh? Yes, yeah. the painting related ones and whatnot. Oh, okay. Another reason Brandon's watching the uh, broadcast is to try to get some ideas. Mm-hmm. So. Have you guys been back to the parks since they've reopened Ask Marbles 84? Oh, no. I haven't. I haven't been anywhere, really. Yeah. Um, I'm still kind of immunocompromised, so I can't go a lot of places. So I'm still still just been at home. But I know the parks are open. Have any of you guys in, um, in the room been to the um, Disney parks since they've reopened? I haven't been even to Disney Springs. Uh, yeah. Has anyone has anyone been there? Um, I... I hadn't went to Disney Springs, as you know. Sadly, um, a pop gallery has has closed. Yeah, that and, um, one is closed. Brandon, um, it's actually his uh, his mother. Yeah. Who um, basically, in my opinion, ran pop ran gallery. Ran pop gallery. Yes, yeah, she um, did. So yeah. uh, it's kind of a it's so kind of a we've kind of yeah it's kind of a sad time. It is. It is sad. Uh, it, but we've inherited Brandon, so that's <laughs> yeah. That's Brandon like... Brandon should be at school right now, yeah. but they basically have not opened. Um, College. We're not. How much info do you want me to give to you, about you, Brandon? I think it's safe for school. Oh, okay. Scad. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, Scad. Um, those SCAD. of you that live in uh, in it's America. Savannah uh, yeah. School of Art and Design, yeah. and that's in Savannah, Georgia. Beautiful Savannah, Georgia. That's um, it. Is a beautiful. Oh, town. actually, I, I got to go up yeah. there a couple weeks ago. Yep. Yeah, Bra- to clean out, help Brandon clean out his storage <laughs> unit. Oh, that was so. Really it was exciting. not a fun trip. I missed out on that trip. Yeah. Oh, Tigger says we just got back from a few days at the parks. It was an awesome trip, but we missed not being able to uh, finish our trip with a visit to Pop Gallery. Oh, huh. I'm sorry about that. Uh, Muriel, uh, who uh, 
is a local. She uh, she says we went to Disney a few days ago. We have reservations for next weekend. Oh yeah, you got to make reservations yeah. at it now too, right? To, like to go. Yes, to and Glenda, who's new to the room, I believe oh, I don't hello. recognize the name, is uh, from South Carolina. Oh, lovely. Hopefully and Shadow Dancer scared. says, I would stab someone to go to SCAD. Aww. But then she says, too expensive. Oh, gosh, yeah. Uh, actually, Brandon Don't and I were talking about Brandon, college no. uh, <laughs> like loans. And, oh, um, yeah, Brandon thinks he's going to be in debt for the next 20 years. Oh, so. man. I'm not, I'm, not a big, I'm not a good person to ask. <laughs> he says he only goes there because there's a scholarship school. involved. Yeah, yeah. That's the whole reason I went to college. I got a... Ryan, so. See, Mubot's still there. He says, if you have a specific question for Jasmine, try to include at Matthew Beckett. That's my screen <laughs> so name. Mubot is still there and he saying stuff like that. Yeah. Oh, um, Mubot's on auto. Basically, I think things. that we milked Mubot for all it was all it was worth. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Oh, Look. Shaylee, I see the little puppy. That's cute. Shaylee's here, Jasmine. Oh, hi, Shaylee. You've been doing oh, good. uh, Shaylee, we've watched all of uh, what we do in the shadows now. Yes, yes, We're we did, Shaylee. There. You'd be very happy to know. Uh, Kazumaka says, oh, I'm sorry, go ahead, sweetie. I said, end the film, too. Yeah. yeah. Anyway. Uh, oh, yeah, we did watch the film. That was yeah, so it's hilarious. I love the like film. That, yeah, that was that great. was fantastic. I've been off island. This is Kazumaka. Oh, I've been oh. off our, our island once in six months. Oh wow! To do the world's fastest zip line, raising money for a local animal rescue shelter. That's pretty cool. That's a reason to leave the house. Yeah, yeah that's good. That's good. Good. Moobot has risen from the ashes, says Bianca. <laughs> I hope you're doing good, Bianca. It's yeah, it's been I forever since I've, I've seen, seen you. I usually arc. just count usually, on shows yeah, to see I you. Say, there are people that I, I'm friends that I just Aww. depend on, like randomly seeing at shows, and it's like when it doesn't happen, I really notice when people are gone. It's it's it, I'll get to it, dude. Incredible. Um, Alicia uh, says Jasmine's looking more beautiful than ever. Ah, uh -huh, thank and, you very and, much. And uh, Alicia <laughs> is in Miami. Uh, I try to so I try to keep tabs on all my yeah. all my peeps. What's that, babe? Uh, Shaylee says it's so good to see you. Uh, Jasmine, you're looking so well. And yes oh. to the shadows. Uh, okay, so uh, did someone had a question yeah. about pop gallery? You said Brandon about the exclusives. Okay, well, I'm, okay, what happens to Jasmine prints only used to be sold at Pop Gallery? Can you now oh. sell them on your website? I don't think we've made a final decision on that, have uh, we, Yeah, Jasmine? I have, still have to see what the uh, online situation is and something else yeah, is I taking think, that over. Yeah, I think but, currently, um, um, uh, go ahead, sweetie. I'm, I, th the ones that, I think the ones that were Pop Gallery exclusive, like those images, there's only two like that, like Luna Mods Wintry and Dragonling. Wintry Dragonling. I think those ones are going to be available through perhaps a Pop website sort of thing. But as far as the limited edition canvases go, Thank you. I think I have the last of the, each of those editions, like the number 42s, like myself. So I'll just auction those on eBay. And then we'll have the open editions then available on strangeling.com. So any of the things that were a pop gallery exclusive, we'll have open editions, possibly in multiple sizes too, um, at strangeling.com. Works for me. Yep. That oh. is the plan. So it's going to take a while to like reformat all that stuff. So we, I've got a million other things catch up with that. but yeah the, yeah this is uh i'm it's nice to hear you talking jasmine it's like oh. you're actually being social it's, it, it was it almost yeah, felt I, strange um, uh when brandon came here the other day yeah. and you're like talking to another human it was like oh yeah jasmine Disturbing can talk to other humans that's that's nice humans. uh glenda uh from south carolina Ooh. says let oh, jasmine know my boyfriend got me the beautiful creatures edition 2 deck oh. And I love your art, and I've thank been a fan you. for years. Oh, thank you very much. And Mimi, you remember Mimi? I remember Mimi. Hi, <laughs> um, Mimi. We miss you, Mimi. Um, good to be we here miss and miss you. you both. When Jasmine has time, uh, will she explain the new painting she is working on? I sure will. Uh, we started to in the beginning, but I think we're trying to catch up with I think folks, that's when we basically. thought the audio wasn't working. Would love to hear all yeah. about it. Absolutely. And I have I have details, too, if um, but Jasmine probably has cooler details. I, I, I do, really. I might take one second to make a bathroom run first, though. I hate to do that right before I start. Do you want me to do our new thing? Yeah, we can do that new... Well, see, we, we're supposed to have, like, a thing that happens... No, not because I'm going to the bathroom. Okay, but, so... But I have, if one has to leave screen for a moment. Right, so we're going to take, a like, a couple minute break like two minutes okay so i think I, usually i wouldn't do this so early but okay guys so you guys so we'll have the music i'm gonna kill the audio and put on a little pretty 
kind of like a little funny commercial for you I guys. haven't even seen what it is, so. All right, we're back. We're back. Did that, it, it paused. You couldn't hear us like talking or anything, right? <laughs> no, uh, yeah, I, I don't think we okay. could. We weren't saying anything bad. So. Yeah, so far uh, yeah. The, our little my little machine thing here is working well. Awesome. You know, um, it's it's a, I think it's a good thing, Jasmine. We might want to add that to our little funny shopping list mm -hmm. here on Twitch. Yeah. In the future, because um, I'm if other people are interested in streaming, they might find something like this useful. Yeah, sure. Yeah, like the technical stuff. Like the, the actual stuff you're using. Uh, oh, hey, Streamlabs mentioned the giveaway again. That's kind of cool. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, Sweet. you do that. Um, we need the Cat of Sonura as a pin of the month. Ooh. Yeah, that I think that would actually be a good that idea be because there's one of Sonura. Yeah. Because there's her, like her portrait. There's a pin of her, I don't know, like her face. And then I could do one of the kitty cat. That would be good. I'm laughing at how many biscuits I see. I'm confused. Something going on with biscuits? I don't know. There are so many things on Twitch that you can fuss with. No kidding. It's a it's a big, confusing, wacky place. It, it really is. Yeah. That's why we need you. Yeah. Awesome. Ooh, Beast Cat would make an amazing pin. Oh, damn <laughs> Our own kitty? Oh, well, okay. So. Well, to be fair. um. Should I? The one in. The oh, I'll one let in, Jasmine um, go. Hey, Gamer's on the bed. Um, oh. But the um, the kitty cat in Senor is based off of Tegrio, so. Oh, Kitten says, please thank Jasmine for making my favorite painting into a pin. I love Allura. Oh. oh we wow. haven't had a broadcast since Allura. My so. gosh, we haven't, have we? Ever? Oh, the, they are Bianca's fans' biscuits. Okay, Bianca. Oh. Okay, so Bianca's little, um, you know how we have our little emoji sticker things on Twitch? Uh-huh. They're able to use those in other streams. Oh, I didn't so know that. So Bianca's, cool. those are Bianca's little biscuits. Okay. And it's a long story. Got okay, it. I'll take okay. your word for it. 
Got it. So I I wanted to show the. Huh? Oh, is that what it does if Gamera comes? That's. <laughs> that's that's a Gamera one. We we made a couple. Oh wow. So well, we might actually get her to visit later. She's. She is a scary little uh, She's a, monster. Uh, for those who don't really have three cats, they're a big part of our lives, and they're all feral cat rescues, so they have very different and strange personalities. Bianca is not a real word. You guys are... You guys are... like I feel like I'm out of the loop there. So <laughs> maybe if I was cool and had another additional 50 hours a week, I could do that. <laughs> is that how long it takes you? Okay, that's cool. It works though. Oh, thank you uh, for subscribing, Titri. Oh, somebody subscribed. If, if I'm pronouncing it right, I always, I never pronounce these names correctly, and I apologize. But thank you so much. We should make always it so correct me. Oh. <laughs> thank you, Sidious. Thank you very Getting much. a lot of subscriptions. Oh, cool. Well, I heard that Patreon's got a new thing where they're doing um, annual prescri uh, subscriptions now, Maddie. Uh, what is it? A Patreon's doing annual subscriptions as an option now. Or oh, are okay. going to or something. Instead of monthly. Yeah, I did pronounce it correctly. Titchery. Oh, good job, um, baby. Th that's interesting. So they just, like, give you... And it's at a discount. Like, you get 10% off. Oh. If, you if, a... if probably if the, uh, if you, the, the creator wants, wants to. Yeah, yeah. Wants to... I was okay. going to do that on mine. All right. That's kind of cool. I'll have to look at it. If I do, I'll announce it. It'd be really cool. But. So um, we do have a... For, so I was talking about giveaways earlier. Um, if For those of you who have, who have used to watch us Twitch last year, we had a giveaway basically roughly every hour. Mm-hmm. So we're, we're going to continue to do that, but the last one is going to be a little bit different. Um, what we're going to do for the first two today is we're going to have the print of the week as a giveaway, and Jasmine showed that earlier. That was Sonura. And then we're going to have, uh, for the second hour, is the, the pin of the month, um, which uh, a few of you have mentioned, and I think Jasmine got one right there. I got one. It's butterflies. Butterflies and bones. It's actually a really, really, that blue pops. For those that have got it in the... Uh, in the mail, yeah, that blue really it's pops. Really, it's, it's gorgeous. It's a really nice pin. Uh, Kieran says that he's ve oh, very hey, happy Kieran. you're feeling much better. Thank you so much, Kieran. And, and nice to see you too, Kieran. Yeah, I hope you guys are all doing good. And uh, for our last giveaway, we're going to do something a little different. Oh yeah. Yeah. So we are going to have we're going to pick a a winner before we uh, pick the prize because we mm -hmm. have this prize wheel that we've added to they our stream. It, to it was nifty. So um, I, um, I added some prizes that I thought you guys would think were awesome. So um, I can, I'm going to preview the prize wheel, but this does not count for anything. So I'm just going to hit it just to show you what it looks like. So what this is the mean? prize wheel, 100% random. It says you want a ca Halloween coloring book. Oh. So that would, in that scenario, someone would would win that. Okay. So, um, we thought that would be super cool. An alligator girl pin. My gosh, blob help. We don't even have one. I don't have one. <laughs> but uh, actually, I have an albino alligator. Yeah, pin. we have her. I have her. Her now. friend. <gasps> I have her sister. <laughs> I do have her. Basically, that's what happens when you run an alligator girl pin through the wash cycle about 200 that's times. That's not true. It's, they're a completely different pin. Oh, yeah. I, yeah, I they are, actually. I, 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 made, yeah. I made it up. Yeah. No, don't Wait, tell people that. Why'd you have me do that? Oh, shut up. <laughs> Quiet, Brandon. <laughs> we would, no, dude. If I found an alligator oh, girl pin, yeah. I think I'd, I don't know, I'd, I'd hold it for dear life until I got home. Yeah. And then I'd tell I'd Jasmine, I'm like, ticket. oh my gosh, I found one. We were so... We thought we were going to find one, like, we're in a couch through. or something, but yeah. we never did. I know. I thought maybe I would when I cleaned out my studio. I did find some other cool pins, though, and those will be some prizes, so that's cool. 
Yeah. Of course, I do have my... I cleaned out my whole entire studio before I reset up everything for Twitch. And yes. Found all sorts of weird stuff. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Hey, how's it going? Leela's here. Oh, hey, Leela. Hope you're doing good. And April likes the prize wheel. Cool. I'm curious to see it in action. It does have original painting on there, right? And that means yes. I have to give an original painting to somebody. It's I not wonder, likely, but yeah, there, there not, is there likely. is a very yeah. slim chance you could win an original painting. Yeah, maybe a big one. I don't know. Oh, actually, I'll go through the prizes that I yeah, currently say the have on there. Yeah, the prizes that are on there. I we might can change, change it for next like, time. Um, I have a every week if we want. And... I have a print of the week. I have a mystery um, pack, the pin set that mm -hmm. um, went over really well. <laughs> we did a couple. <laughs> accidentally went over really well. Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah then we have uh, yeah. two sizes of canvas print. Uh, 10 by 10 canvas print and that would be one if they they'd have to specify what image they'd want yeah uh, and a 16 by 20 canvas print we have um, a mini metal pin set a uh, number one two three Ooh, and four as prizes yeah. a forever strange book the Ooh. halloween co coloring book and an original painting those are all those prizes are on the spinning wheel okay so original painting, dude. i think it's pretty cool stuff what is Jasmine using to paint in this part of her painting, asked Brenny. This is just a skinny little um, paintbrush. Um, it's a script liner brush made by Royal Clear Grip. They're like $2.99. And I'm using some titanium white. No, not titanium white. Titan buff. That's what I have. Titan buff golden fluid acrylic. And I've drawn on a mixture of brown and blue for the lines, and I'm putting white, or the titanium buff, which is like almost white, I'm using that as highlighter. So when I'm like, oh, I want it to be bright here, I know when I put the little light dots there, that's where I'm gonna make it light. So just paint and water, acrylic paints. There you go. Uh, and anyways, this painting is called Hyacinth Blue. You probably don't know that yet because I don't have any colors in it, but hyacinths are very blue. Don't know if you can, actually, I'm gonna try to zoom out. Give me a second and see if this works. So I have, no, not that way. I'm looking at a picture of cool. some hyacinths here. Oh. <laughs> I can see it. Oh, yeah, awesome. Those I, are I some hyacinths that. that I printed out a picture so, of. Yeah. Uh, Gabriel's watching. It's a type of flower. Oh, R hi, Gabriel. R you know, Ricky's Ricky's, I, Ricky's Gabriel. Gabriel. Yeah. Richard's Gabriel. No. And A. Kester says, does Jasmine find there is no difference between cheap and expensive brushes? So Jasmine has her... Go ahead with your spiel. <laughs> well, I the brushes I tend to use are cheap brushes. But I am a vegetarian and I don't use animal hair brushes, so... I buy cheap, not especially great brushes. So I'm not a good person to ask. I find that cheap brushes painted all my paintings, so they were good enough for that, basically. <laughs> if that makes sense. But there are people, I'm sure there are better brushes out there. They probably do cost more, but they might be made out of, you know, mink or whatever. Nah. The, so, what I just I did? I don't like it. Uh, when, when I hover over, there's like a little arrow. It's new. I haven't seen it. And I hit click to reply. It's actually really good for chat. Is it something in the chat room you're talking yeah, about? Yeah. Um, you know how I have we have a, like a, a lot of scrolling going on? Yeah. Well, now there's a reply arrow. Oh. So I can directly reply to people. It's pretty sweet. Oh, that's very nice. Um, that way I'm... It's, like if a specific person It's very easy question. to miss people, and I don't want them to feel Left out. neglected. Yeah. Have so, you ever, we never neglect you on purpose. Folks. Right. If you ask a question, just type it in there. Right. And, Matt will read it out loud because I can't. I'll read do my it best. I I'm a fallible, I'll try to answer. disgusting human, but I'll I'll do my best. The wheel is loaded with goodies. It's like uh, you knew what we liked. Yeah. <laughs> well, I do. You do kind of tell us, you Alicia. Do tell us what you like. <laughs> this is fun. But yeah, as um, you have 140 viewers, so um, oh my goodness. Yeah, sometimes it's harder to keep track I, I, of, I, I, of chat. I, it's so funny. I'm sorry, I just haven't seen anybody for a while. Well, I think a lot of people also, yeah, of people um, <laughs> let, let me ask you what, what you think about this, Jasmine. Do you think a lot of people since, since the, uh, COVID stuff, uh, yeah. do you think that people have gotten more used to zoom and other ways of talking via camera? Probably. So this is actually more palatable. This probably. I've, I've never actually used zoom. Have I? No, I've still, I, 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 I barely use telephones. So I've decided yeah. I, I loathe I it. I don't know. 
I don't, I don't. I do this. I do Twitch. That's that's about it. After spending so much time with a lion, the idea of roaring becomes more acceptable. That's, that's true. That's a, like sounds like an ancient wisdom, little sort of saying. I, I like that. I'm not going to remember it, <laughs> but I'll dream about it. So it's very cool, Jasmine. Um, you can't see it in the chat, but basically, uh -huh. um, it says Streamlabs. Mm -hmm. I think we can change the name, can't we, uh, Brandon? The robot. We, we can change the name of Streamlabs to like. We could. I think we can. I, I think I saw. We could call it like, I don't know, Jasmine Bot or Strangeling Bot or something mm -hmm. like that. Give it a more appropriate name. Okay. Um, and then it won't say Streamlabs. But anyway, it keeps really good track of uh, the raffles, Jasmine. Oh. Okay. It looks like it's doing it. That's good. Uh, I, Brenny said, I met you two at pop, uh, at a pop-up in Seattle a few years ago. Oh! Glad to see you again, Jasmine. Good to see you! Oh, I bet it was at, um... Alex. Alex's, yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Man, yeah, I, I hear forever. that a few, a couple of those, uh, galleries have, I think, closed yeah, I know. in that area. And that was a, that was really cool area i know it really made me feel like you we were an underground art thing <laughs> <laughs> it did no I, that was that was a lot of fun yeah but i i, I, totally no, I think it, i think it's hard for a lot of galleries um especially right now i don't i think i think a lot of galleries might not might have problems after this uh, virus it's not um an industry people are necessarily spending a lot of time at right now but so, we're online so. jasmine what paints yeah. do you use I use gold and fluid acrylics mostly. See, what, the paint thing. Um, I was on here. Yeah. I use um. I'll it's show a you it's a, a FAQ. It's a frequently sure. asked question. It is one that gets asked a lot. So we're trying to figure out a creative way to address it. Yeah. In the future. Gold and fluid acrylics. This one's Naples yellow. But... Uh, Bianca says the galleries have hit been hit really hard this year. Yeah, I bet. Um, conventions and galleries. It's like. Oh, yeah. Um. How's yeah. a how's a pick gallery doing? Um. Bianca, because uh, oh, that's the one at Universal. Yeah, the one at Universal. Yeah. I don't, I haven't been. I know that you. I saw your things there. I believe. I think. Yeah, they had their little cuties there. Is there any new new on the Poe pin set? <laughs> I wonder who's asking that. Can you guess who's Hi, asking Lila. that? <laughs> so, it's been eight months. I uh, almost died. <laughs> FYI, guys, Jasmine actually doesn't see the chat, so she just knew that Leela specifically <laughs> no, was I, asking. No, I'm guessing. Yeah, I, I'm being honest but um uh, but my main thought uh, has been the pin set see karen <laughs> in the room um that's leela is karen's mother and then nigel is there uh, are friends the, from england is the father in the family <laughs> so that they they often see us at twitch and they live in the, uh they live in the england oh oh it it's closed oh is that one closed too? yeah, yeah. man man that was that had some cool stuff. I on know there. that was like one of the better places yeah. to go at Universal, man. And Pop was one of the better places at Disney. Well, at least um, Disney Wise have still got the the co-op gallery or the um, co-op and the Wonderground galleries at Disneyland and Disney World, and they'll continue to be doing those. In fact, they're probably going to be keeping me busier than ever. And I, what I have been mostly been working on that I can't show you guys has been Disney stuff like in the past few weeks. So it's, that's part of the reason I didn't start Twitch quite as early as I wanted to, because I can't show the ones that when I'm working for Disney, like broadcast. So it's, I had to wait till I was working on something that wasn't Disney <laughs> so I could show you guys. Yeah. So Jasmine, that's going to be um, a lot. <laughs> I think I'm the excited. only people that have seen it besides some of the, some people like me and Brandon and like, Disney. Yeah, just yeah. just you guys, yeah. Yeah. But you guys will get to see eventually and then I'll show you as soon as Disney lets me. Uh, but that'll be stuff that we're coming out for Epcot and maybe some stuff before oh, then too. Cool. They still I don't think have even released the my gosh, my uh, the blue uh, uh, Pinocchio and I'm trying to think. In Villain's group portrait, I don't think those are even in California. Yeah. I don't know. Because they keep telling me they're going to have me out there for to release those. Yeah, my... Um, <laughs> like, okay, yeah, I'll I, well, I, I feel like I'm so close, but so far to, to, <sighs> to Disney the right now. Yeah. Um, Leslie said, was so sad when I read Pop Gallery clothes. I saw you there several times. Sweet yeah, memories. Aw. Um, what are they putting in, like, 
like a donut store? <laughs> hey, this is good news, Jasmine. This is cool. Did, and oh, let me that? ask you if you knew this. Uh, I'm fine. Katie uh, from oh. Kansas City. Yeah. Uh, she said Boulevard Brewery teamed up with the Nelson Atkins Museum. Oh. And released a special Pilsner where 100% of the funds go to the Nelson. Oh, really? Did you oh, hear that? that's fabulous. I did not know that. I keep seeing people post about the Nelson then because um, the penguins that they let in. I oh, swear, uh, everybody shared that with me. Pit closed in February before COVID hit. Oh, oh, so it wasn't COVID oh, related. So it was oh, it was already okay. closed. Oh, okay. Well, I, I guess Universal needed the space for an, another Universal store. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Pop Gallery's turned it into donut store, Disney. What's up with that? Yeah. Aren't enough donuts at Disney World, I guess. Uh, Kazumaka says, I'm sure some of our galleries are open again in Wales. As yeah. we... As we are ruled by the Welsh government alongside English, we have more relaxed rules. Ah, yeah. Okay. Probably so. Um, I'd planned on going to MegaCon before it was canceled this year. This <laughs> is Wizard Banger. Uh-huh. I bought several items last year and oh. planned to buy more art to decorate my new home. So sad everything had been canceled. Uh, gosh. It's, we're all sad about that. And we, and... Uh, apologies too. A lot of you guys have been asking us, like, "Hey, do you know when Disney's gonna open this ride, or do you know when the Ren Fair is gonna open, or if it is?" We we really don't ever know that. We other, we sometimes might find do. out like an hour before you guys. Sometimes <laughs> sometimes it's about ten minutes or an hour, and I'm like, "Hey, I can tell everybody," and then by then they've already announced it. So it's like, eh, I don't know. But yeah, we don't really know that stuff ahead of time. And it's usually the company or the convention or the show isn't even deciding then either. They're waiting for the county to give them guidelines. And otherwise they can't get their deposit back. So they can't announce it's closed until the county tells them to. So it's, there's a reason why everything is like that. Is it? It's just my connection, probably. Yeah. But it should be. Is really your good. computer okay, babe? Oh, yeah. I was, I was making sure Brandon's was. Oh, okay. Because if my, if I can see you actually, but um, I'm just a little fuzzy right now, but it's not a big deal. Sure, I could adjust it. Yeah. And I think I have a different big no, bug than I Yeah, Brandon, know. change it to 720p on mine, and it looks spiffy. Yeah, maybe oh. we can go up more, but it might Was mine no, set at the right one over thing? I'm, I'm happy with 720. It looks really good, actually. Brandon likes to watch uh, Twitch a lot, mm. so it kind of understands it better than... Cool. Oh, someone said that they would love to see... Um, Merida from Brave. A, a I few would people too, in the room. man. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I could. I, maybe I'll go into that more later. But I'd, I'd like to see Merida. But I have some other Disney ones that are in the works, so I don't get to decide always so much. But actually, the one I'm work I just finished was one I specifically kind of t told Disney I wanted to do, and they let me. So that was really cool. Jasmine. Yeah. Yeah. Have you had a, you haven't had a Pixar release before, have you? Pixar, I'm trying to think. No, because um, uh, Tangled, Tangled was, was still Tangled Disney, is featuring Disney, Disney featuring animation. It was Disney, Disney featuring animation, it was not Pixar, so. Um, even though a lot of people no, don't know I've that. No, I've had some ones that were Disney Lucasfilm. I'm, I'm if if she, I mean, if, yeah, if she was able to do that. Yeah. For those who don't know, sometimes I am hey, working uh, for Disney as an artist, in, an independent contractor. Uh, so if you've ever seen me doing critter, Disney stuff, it's not fan art, it's out. stuff Disney has hired me to paint. So that's why also there are rules sometimes, like I can't show you this until a release date or whatever. But this painting here is not one of those. Happy. This is destined for my solo show at the Corey Helford Gallery, and the name of this painting is Hyacinth Blue. It is a color of blue. It's also a type of flower. Um, the name Hyacinth is a name out of Greek mythology. Um, I've got a, I'm gonna have some kind of frescoes and things in the background that are crumbling away that show um, Apollo and Hyacinthos, Hyas Hyacinth, whatever you want to call them. I've also got a little Greek vase down here. Jasmine, uh -huh. how, how'd you come up with the name Strangeling? Um, I didn't come up with the name Strangeling. Oh, okay. Um, well, my uh, my husband Matt came up with the name Strangeling. Uh, we just had our the 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 website Strangeling dot com is my website. You probably know. We just had the website's twenty third anniversary. That's something that happened while I've been gone. 
Um, I started it back in 1997. It was also about 23 odd years ago that I met my husband Matt and he gave me the nickname Strangeling, which was part strange, part changeling, equal strangeling. And that's a name I used to start my website. And like, I used it as a handle online a lot back in the 90s <laughs> on AOL and stuff. So that's why it's Strangeling. My real name is Jasmine Beckett Griffith, which is really long and spelled wrong, so. Uh, Karen has a question for you oh, there. Oh, what's that, babe? I don't think I've shown that to you. Oh, were you talking to me? Uh, no, I was talking to Brandon. When I, when I talk a little quieter, I'm trying to talk to Brandon. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Uh, Karen was asking Brandon if uh, Brandon had seen his uh, fan base U- YouTube, YouTube oh, he probably has. Uh, channel yeah. based on your uh, Twitch streams. Exclamation ra- raffle, uh, Max Schwartz. Exclamation point, R A F F L E, all one letter. Yeah, I'll, or all, I'll show all you. One word. Yeah. I'll if type Ma- it in. If Matt ever Do wins that accidentally, we won't let him now win. Now I'm apparently in the uh, raffle. You're in the raffle, cutie. Raffle, you're at 151 viewers, Jasmine. Ooh, hi, everybody. And I'll, uh, hopefully, we'll be doing this every Sunday around, unless something weird, we're on, if we're on vacation somehow or whatever. Um, uh, three o'clock Eastern time, same time as today. A little bit earlier for you, uh, for you folks that don't live in the U.S. It might be easier for you. Yeah. So yeah. I know that. Well, I mean, I guess we're gonna keep you up until it's usually five hour, five hours off. Five. five yeah, they're six five hours, hours ahead currently. Currently in yeah. England, yeah. <laughs> Bianca <laughs> says, "I hope you win." <laughs> I know I entered myself. Um, if I win, I, I I'll, like I'll figure out a way to pick somebody car. else. Yeah. Yeah, because I I don't think that I think Moobot maybe would give me the option to pick yet another winner. I'm not sure if you're not sure if this one does. I'm not either. sure about Cloudbot. I don't know about Cloudbot, man. Yeah, it's a whole different sort of bot. Cloudbot's kind of like a. a You'll be able to it. Oh, I can. Oh, okay. Brandon said I could, and the fact that Brandon said like I could Liz. means it's true. Yeah. All you doubters out there you doubting Kazumaka Brandon. says I'm good at staying awake sinking a bottle of wine drowning my <laughs> sorrows oh my gosh wow I'm oh I hear you I've been there I usually <laughs> pair that with I Conan the, Conan for some reason I'm missing wine hey um actually I had some what was it three days ago I forget I don't know side I note um Brandon and I made a list uh is this cool if I tell them about our movie list Brandon oh, yeah. Yeah, so well, Brandon, we put him on the spot. No, that, Ask well, him live. On I, the air. I don't want him. I don't want him to feel uncomfortable. So uh, Brandon and I made a list of <laughs> movies that I feel a young man. What are you? Twenty two. Twenty three. He's a puppy. What are you? How old are you? Twenty two. Uh, Brandon's twenty two. Oh. Uh, movies that I think a young man should see, and uh, Conan the Barbarian was on there, and he hadn't seen it. And as you guys know, I'm an insane movie buff, so <laughs> I created this list. Uh, it's hilarious because it's on the. Um, it's a guide any, for young men specifically. It, I have it written like at our other studio. Are there? Are um, there I have it I written on one of those uh, backing boards we use for prints, and as we go through them, we just mark them off. So, uh, the last one we watched was Taxi Driver. Every and Brandon's like, I think that, that might be stuff. more of a Matt movie, but I appreciate it in one regard. I forgot what his review. Yeah. <laughs> So Kazumaka says, "Fear and Loathing and Where the Buffalo Roam oh, are a must." Oh, those are both great. Yeah, I don't he, know if you've seen those. Or read, or read, how about reading? Yeah, put Hunter S. Thompson on there. Heck yeah. Oh, uh, Brandon's an animator and uh, game designer. At least that's what he's going yeah, to school for. Yeah, yeah, that's Brandon. Yes. That's what he does. And I, and you know, I, I throw a few bucks his way. So he has to. If I say he has to watch a movie, he has to. <laughs> he's on my clock. He's technically nine. Matt's assistant. Commando oh, Fight Club. Actually, Fight Club is on the list, sir. Oh. Uh, that's Blob Help. Oh, okay. American Ninja hey. is not on the list, but I might add that. Blob Help <laughs> is, a, is a fellow movie buff. These are um, Matt's suggestions, movie buff. not mine. Yeah. Again, these are Watch Matt's Joker's Taxi Driver mine. only better. Um, I, ooh, Matt is, I Matt don't know is if I could say that. But Joker film, aren't you, baby? Creepily, those are movies I keep watching over <laughs> yeah, and say, over hey, again. I've seen Joker probably about... I'd say, I'd honestly, I'd seen it probably about about seven times since it's come out. Yeah. But um, he has not seen that yet. The Lost Boys. You've probably seen The Lost Boys, though, haven't you, Brandon? The oh, Lost Boys. That's a good movie. Brandon, have you seen The Lost Boys? I think Mom had it on in the background all the time. 
I'm sure your um, mom knows it, Brandon. Um, I'm sure Jen knows. Brandon's mother is like exactly my my age, yeah. minus uh, she and a Matt couple have months. A lot more inc- you you guys often know movies she, like, she more she than knows, I would. Yeah, she even, knows a lot of the same stuff yeah, I do. You guys are like exactly the same age. Anyway. Cabin in the Woods. That's a, a newer one, but have you seen that one? You you actually might dig that one, Cabin in the Woods. Luke just posted a review of that. Man. Oh, okay, it's horror. Did you see Luke just posted a review of that one? Chappie. You know, I was, I you have seen Chappie, okay. I haven't seen Chappie. And someone said Wait. District 9. You might like that one. I saw this. Did I see District 9? I remember reading about it before I was, when I was in I South showed Africa. that one to mom, actually. District 9? Yeah. Oh. She liked it. She thought it was, uh. I have seen the movie. Yeah. <laughs> I remember you, you had a mini review on, um, I think it was yesterday. Oh, that's yeah. Oh, I'm, I won't say, I won't say what you said. <laughs> Donnie cool. Darko. Donnie oh, Darko Donnie is, great. is hey, a fantastic love film. That movie. Um, I it has enjoy got all the tears for fierce you, songs you, you had, and everything. Dude, have you seen soundtrack. Beetlejuice? Okay, he's seen Beetlejuice. Okay, that's a good one. I'm agreeing with some of these. Some of these. Are... There's just a lot of things I haven't seen. And you've seen, uh, you saw Edward Scissorhands. That's, that's a good so, film. Okay, so you've seen some Tim Burton stuff. Okay. okay. District 9 is overrated. Sorry, says Blob Help. I enjoyed it. I didn't see it. I think it's exactly right. I remember reading about it and people telling me I should watch it before I went to South Africa, but it, does it take place in South Africa? Uh, it takes, I don't know if it's South Africa, it? but it does take place in Africa somewhere. Okay. I'm not sure where. But maybe it was from... Deliverance. Okay. That's, a, I, that's a movie I've actually only seen once. Well, I guess you at least didn't watch <laughs> it repeatedly on the loop. I don't know. Nine is the best movie related to the number nine. Really? That's what Brandon says. Oh, okay. Did you see nine? I love nine. Nine's good. A lot of people hated it. I got brain scan is oh brain scan rocks. Nine is amazing. Edward Furlong, Jasmine. Oh, you remember yeah. brain scan? That's cool. I know brain scan. It was South Africa. Yes. Uh, I thought, okay, because of apartheid. Like, mm, yes, yes, and I was going to the apartheid museum. That's, people are like, you should watch District 9. And I'm like, okay. I, I was, hope uh, that's, I that sounds like it. about Nelson Mandela, but okay. A depressing place, <laughs> the Apartheid Museum. <laughs> you were, you know when they even go there. I haven't been there. You haven't even been to Africa. No, well, I haven't. Where, where it says it, it sounds like a depressing. Uh, apartheid oh, Museum sounds like well, a depressing it's, place. It's, it's, no, it was, it was pro-apartheid. <laughs> no, Jesus. No. <laughs> Jasmine. Sorry. Brain scan is cool, trickster. Yes, brain scan is cool. It's very meta. I won't, I won't say too much. It's I like it. Very metal. Vivian. Would it, it's agree. metal. Yeah, it's very metal. That's what yeah, I meant to say. It, it's actually. Oh. It, it's pretty. It's. It's well done. Oh, even better. Yeah, that it's well done. No, that it's metal. It's metal. <laughs> it actually yeah, is a little bit. Very metal. The, the Wizard with Fred very Savage. Meta. It's got, it I am not going to make. Uh, <laughs> I'm not going to make Brandon me. watch the Wizard. The um, wizard? That's like the worst. The, it's is not that the, like the Wiz? It's. I'm gonna have to say my review of the Wizards is it's so bad. Oh, it's the, so the bad. Nintendo one. Yeah. Okay, I was thinking the Wiz. Logan's Run is phenomenal. Okay. Princess Bride, you've had to have seen. Oh, Prince Logan, uh, Logan's Run. I love okay. Princess Bride. That's Flash great. Gordon. Flash Logan's Gordon. Queen soundtrack. Actually, I was talking. We about were that. just talking because you kept telling. Or should I? It was, I thought it was a misstep, Manny. But what? Wait, what? What? When you were confusing Brian Blessed with... Oh, shut up. <laughs> See? You don't want me even saying it because it's embarrassing. Yeah. And you argued me. No, I didn't argue. Yes, I was confused did. for a second. You what? I was confused for a second. I was confused for a minute and a half. And I was giving you clues. Yes. And telling him his wife's name. And then I said, the... oh, I said, is he a blessed man? <laughs> yes. Yeah. And you said, yes, he is blessed. Yeah. Well, I even made, like, pagan jokes and stuff. I, I... Little Monsters is actually really good, Wizard Banger. Which one? L- Little Monsters. It has Fred Savage in it. It's I'm actually not, not a bad it. flick. Is it like... I a... think it's something a like when he was whole a family could enjoy. Okay. Particularly when they... Um, the It's be- becoming friends with the monster under your bed. That's what oh, it's about. Like Monsters, Inc. Yeah. What did you think of South Africa, Jasmine? Closet. I love South a Africa. I want to get back there. I wanted, Super, I wanted to get back there again, but we weren't able to travel, unfortunately. But um, I was planning a, like a, a big sort of event of having fans come and stuff too, but we weren't able to make that work. So hopefully, sometime relatively soon, I will get to go back to Africa. Maybe Maddie will come with me. Yep, I'd like to. I or just whoever. have to. Um, I just have to learn to 
except watching giant kitties eat eat other little animals. deer. That's true. So. Yeah, we saw a, a cheetah. I'm trying to get they better were at so that. Hungry, I, I, though, honestly, the babies. They were the starvingest cheetahs you ever seen, just in the wild. And their tummies were like this big around, and they got a kudu, which is like a deer with big horns on it, and. They just jumped it and just eviscerated it right in front of us. So we watched them eat it for like a half hour. But it's, Matt, yeah, you, we would not have. Maddie is like, if, if that happened on TV, it, you'd often not want to even be I'm better. At TV, I'm better now. Let alone it yeah. in front of you sort of things. So I don't know why. It, it's, it's got a trigger warning. I actually did really well with, in the backyard the other day with the lizards. You did? Yeah. Yeah. Proud. So, there's... I'm trying to become more of an animal lover rather than, you know, worry about them constantly. Because, you know, I, I try to recognize that there's an animal kingdom, a uh, dog-eat-dog <laughs> yeah. sort of thing. Uh, where in South Africa did you visit? I'm from Johannesburg. Oh, cool. I went to Me. Johannesburg. Actually, um, let's see. I went to Johannesburg, and that is where I went to the Apartheid Museum, was there. I spent um, a decent amount of time in Cape Town, which is, like, one of my favorite ever cities now. Um, uh, we went outside. Did, did it pick a winner, dude? I'm Kruger, sorry. Kruger uh, um, State Park, or a national park. And oh, now I pick, I, I think I pick a winner. for a long time and went out every day on Oh, Art of Bianca won. Then I, I also went around other parts of Africa. Jasmine, Art of Bianca won. Oh, Bianca won? We were just talking about it. What are you doing, dude? Uh oh. The camera's frozen. Apparently. Oh, Jaisa. Uh oh. The, um, the camera on on my artwork's frozen. Oh, sorry, guys. You probably have seen me talk and wave my hands around. <laughs> but we went to other parts of Africa too. Went to um, Namibia slash Botswana. Went to Zimbabwe. Is that working? Yay! Yay! Zambia went to Victoria. You have to show me what you did, dude, because that's that happened a, a long time ago, and I didn't know what to do without oh. restarting the whole broadcast. Okay. Man. Okay. So, um, Bianca won. Huh? Bianca won. So Bianca won. So yeah, Bianca. Let me. Hey, Bianca, if if you don't want to sign friends, I understand. No, why wouldn't she? I don't know. I just think it's funny She's when like, gonna a get friend one or, whether like, she likes it or not. Win. Huh? She's going to get it whether you want it or not, Bianca. Okay. You can always gift it to somebody. What's up, dude? <laughs> oh, th this is what I'm doing here is I'm just I'm just old school in it. Like that. Can I see? So, that? I'm looking more on what her do, face. I wonder if I can on. zoom in even more. Sorry yeah. guys, I don't want to ruin hit the winner. camera. Start doing a little bit more shading on the face. Yes, she says she would love it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thanks, Bianca. So I put the instructions there, Bianca. Just email me and and I'll uh, I'll give your address out to everybody. Yeah, we'll let everybody That's know how we your roll. schedule. No. <laughs> Hey, we do eventually want to have like guests and stuff on our show though, so I it, I would like to talk to fellow artists up here. Yeah, that's another yeah. thing that we're uh, that we need to figure out is uh, how to get guests on here. Yeah. Um, that we appreciate. Yeah. Like other artists. Not like how people. to convince people to come on here, but how to physically technically do it. I'll I'll definitely let y'all know as I'm. Yeah, you don't. Yeah, you don't. Don't have send to come us over resumes or whatever. Yeah. We're trying to figure out how to do virtual. Yeah, we're trying to figure out how to actually do that with the wires and whatnot okay so what i needed what i should do is um brandon i usually used to set like a timer on my iphone i am putting and some... when it went off i'd hit click winner that's what i'll do in the future More actually you can set a timer on the stream deck on top of okay cool background to start off as a 16 by 20 piece of wood here masonite panel actually and you just I've... answered their question Oh. They asked what type of canvas is Jasmine using? Oh, <laughs> masonite <laughs> panel. Awesome. It's a panel. Yeah, a piece of panel. It's a bit. Mostly, I work on a piece of wood or masonite panel, depending if I need to cut it to a specific size. And I'll gesso them. This is one a gesso I made myself out of um, other uh, plain gesso, and I mixed it with some gray, brown, blue, and some purple. And I use that to do a couple layers on top of the wood, so it kind of gives it a, a rougher texture. So when I smooth, when I 
kind of paint on it. It'll have a bit of texture, a bit of tooth on it. And I'm going through with a soft brush and putting some lighter bits of that same color I mixed with the gesso and a bit of Titan buff and a bit of titanium white. And I am going over where the highlights on her face are going to be, just showing the roundness of the shape of her face and not so much worrying about the light source yet. I'm just knowing that, hey, her cheeks out, stick out further than the bridge of her nose and her forehead sticks out a little bit because she's round. Other than that, um, I haven't really put a lot of thought into where the light source is going to be in the painting. I want it to be very directed because I want her to be holding some flowers in a vase in, in her lap, kind of, and I want to have an interesting background with the historical um, Greco-Roman myth reference things in it, and then I want her to be kind of a moody character in the front, really dramatically lit. So I kind of am feeling everything out while I'm working on her face. What was that? I put up one of our funny little... <laughs> she doesn't <laughs> talk about art too much. Here's a kitty cat. <laughs> it's okay. Your tone board looks a warmer tone than your gray. New technique? Oh, Is jazz oh are you going to do any... Before that, um, Black Orchid Fairy asked a while ago, and I, I apologize, like I said, okay. I'm fallible. Is Jasmine going to do any Dragonling paintings for her solo show? Uh, if it fits in with the theme. It's Enigma, so it's a show about codes and things. So I don't know if there'll be a Dragonling one. There is one that has a dragon in it, but it's kind of might be more of a scary sort of dragon. I haven't decided yet. Um, oh. But yeah, this is um, the, the painting I'm working on now, I, the gesso I used. Every time I do a, diff a, pain a different painting, I usually use a different color of gesso since, uh, and I make, I tone it myself. This one is a little bit warmer because I knew I was going to be using a lot of cool tones since it's going to be um, hyacinth the girl's um, eyes and blue, so it, the shadows would be warmer and there's going to be a lot of blue overtones. And that would, if you have something that's really bright blue or a really cool bright color, the shadows are warmer. And if you put warmer flesh tones by it, it they'll look a lot warmer too. Jasmine. So I, I put more kind of brown in the gesso. Yeah. Can you explain a few all? Uh, this is the, this is their question, and explain exactly what happened. Sure. Uh, Matt and Jasmine, you gave the Megacon 2020 pins out to Patreon members. Are all other event pins canceled until the event gatherings again? Can you explain? Oh God, I'm trying to even remember. Um, Megacon pins. Which ones were you? you uh, the um, we had three pins designed for Megacon, and Megacon got canceled. So I had one the was pins. one is the the event or sorry the uh, Patreon exclusive. One is now. the Patreon exclusive currently, and that's the that only one we have albino done. Albino alligator girl. Right. We did give that's not true, Maddie. We did give away some um, like of a, the um, voodoo in purple. Didn't didn't you stick some in the mystery packs or did you not? I didn't stick any of those in the mystery okay, packs. Okay, right. no. not voodoo in purple. We already have that one. Are we doing green? Right. That and that was to a um, that was a prize for something. Yeah, that was a prize for something. Yeah, and so, that was. But we but we that we've only we, done that with one person ever. Yeah, I think we gave one yeah. person one. But this, <laughs> so we the, still have the set because yeah, we thought that, at the time we thought Megacon was going to keep. Asked it about pa uh, Patreon people specifically, like those were available to Patreon. People. Oh no, no, nobody can get those. The, no, the only thing we already had. We the basically pins. substituted. Yeah, them. we just thought we're, we hadn't made a new Patreon pin, so I was like, hey, we can make this one. I've already paid thousands of dollars to have it made, <laughs> and Megacon didn't happen, so um, I used it for the Patreon pin. And the other one for Patreon, or not for Patreon, for um, Megacon was Orange Mask. And that one we are just going to keep till, me till Megacon happens next year, right? That's the plan. Because I wanted, it happens in the Orange County Convention Center, so it has oranges, and it's in Florida, and it's, you know, is orange, so I I, I would feel silly oh. putting it for sale somewhere else, or at a different, oh. having it in England wouldn't make any sense. I didn't you start know. up the next one yet. I need to get used to this. The so that's, dude. Um, that's what happened to the pins. One of them is the Patreon-only pin, and you can get her right now if you want. It's Albino Alligator Girl. And the other one, one person was gifted one back when we thought Megacon was going to happen. The other 200 pins or whatever it is will be given out for something else. Don't know yet. And Orange Mask will be at next Megacon to keep up with the Orange County theme. Okay. Was that what they were asking? I I think you you over answered. Okay. Um, Thanks. Yeah, guys, uh, it's a little different than in the past. Uh, you got to enter each raffle now. That's how this new system works. 
It's not our rules, it's bots. Yeah, or we'll always blame it on the bot. <laughs> Uh, Gl Glenda, you did see your name highlighted. I gave you like a smile because you mentioned that you liked the colors and I thought that was a sweet thing to say. Aww. So I like winked at you or something. I love that your pins are trilogies, says someone. Said. <laughs> uh, the first giveaway was one by Art of Bianca, who uh, apparently has biscuits. <laughs> <laughs> apparently she got the biscuits. So. She's got yeah, the biscuits. Yeah, she got the biscuits. Go Bianca. Which, you know, are pretty common these days. Everyone's baking, right? I'm not. I'm not baking either. I've been eating, like, raw vegan for months. Yes. Long. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, like, cooking. I'm just eating raw vitamins. Straight. Yeah, and, and a it's ticket healthy. just means, like, an, yeah. a virtual ticket. Like, it's uh, a, ra a real raffle. So that's all that means. But yeah. It's not. Is, does it call it a ticket? It's, yes, it says that's you received one tickets. One ticket? One ticket, and then in parentheses, it has oh, an S oh, okay. to cover all. I thought I'd remove Both one that. and I anything have to other do it to one. each one, apparently. Yeah. You can win? Uh, In-house jargon. Don't worry about it. Oh, don't worry. Okay. I won't. Thank you for doing the albino alligator girl pin. I finally have an alligator girl, Yay! says Tigger. Yay. You are very, 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 very welcome. I might even do another, another variant eventually, but I don't know. Because I we see little white alligators, they're lovely, and they're all albino alligators. In, yeah, in, I forget what life. um, there is an albino alligator. What is the other type that has the blue eyes? They have they're a they're just a, a white alligator. It's a, but they have a funny name. They, uh, um, I could Google it. A white alligator with blue eyes. They're called yeah. a such and such alligator. American alligator. No, <laughs> they have a neat oh. name. Oh, okay. It's it's to di differentiate it between the albino alligator. Alabaster. I've decided. Will there, there be a alabaster. crocodile girl? Huh? Well, maybe if there we could, lived in Well, the thing is, Africa. I can use the same mold because you can tell crocodiles apart from alligators because crocodiles' teeth go on the outside and alligators' teeth are on the inside. Right? Yeah. Okay. They both bite. They both bite. Crocodiles are mean and alligators aren't really. Uh, crocodigators are... <laughs> I call them both crocodigators just for ease. What about but, a froggo no. girl? A what? A froggo girl. I, I've, you know, I've painted a lot of girls with frogs. I could make one into a pen. Have I done? I did daydreams and frogs had a frog. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to think. Mary of says we, we need a variant of Fire Ninja Dragonline. Huh. Is there anything on her that looks like fire? I'm trying to remember. That would look stupid if it was a different color. I don't know. I'm she would, unsure. I'm trying to think. She could kind of... Like if it was blue, it could kind of well, look blue, like blue it might look fire. Like blue, it might look like the blue ninja. Yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah, that's yeah. true. But blue ninjas, you see her whole They're body. They're based off of these, actually. Brandon, you might see. They're like, you've seen the ninja statues, haven't you? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. They're based off those. And, and the artwork, obviously. Well, the thing is, the um, ice ninja, um, the blue ninja, rather, pin... It's her whole body, and the fire ninja is just her face. You know, Manny? Uh, yes. Okay. So why yes. would it look like the other one? I, I, I didn't <laughs> know if someone would confuse the two. Yeah. I don't know. Or what you People would People might confuse the two. I could always make it something completely different than any of those ones. That'd be super cool. Uh, Fuchsia's Moon Girl, or Fuchsia Moon Girl, rather, says, Ooh. Does Jasmine have a favorite painting she has done? So one of your paintings, rather one than... One of my paintings? Um, uh, one at the museum or something. Yeah, um... Yeah, I, I do. I have it changes so much though, and it's usually for weird reasons. Um, I like Archambaldo Mermaid a lot. That one's pretty cool. I like that one. I like Dress of Sinners, Dress of Saints a lot. Someone says Fire Ninja would look good as a purple variant. Oh, yeah, that sounds cool to me. I'm trying to think of the ninjas. There's Hotaru. She had like kind of purple stuff, but she didn't look very much like that character. Jasmine. Yeah. Have you done any paintings with daffodils in it? The daffodil is uh, the national flower of Wales. Oh, you know I have. I have. Um, there's a there's a faces of there are two faces of fairy. I think that have daffodils. There's also a springtime fairy. I did. Gosh, Mandy, it was in one of those silver ovals. 
and oh wow it was a long time ago she had daffodils i've um several of the still lifes i've done have daffodils in them but they're not often the main part of the painting i had a fairy called daffodil or little 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 daffodil i forget um who was based off of a statue design i did of some fairies that had daffodils so I've done some, but I can't think of any specific ones I'd have prints of him. Jasmine. Yeah. Um, Do a lot of stuff. Anything yeah. planned for New York after uh, post-COVID? I would love to. Um, I'm Theoretically, I might be involved with it. Well, I was invited to be pause? part of a show. It's um, frozen? At... Oh, we think we're frozen again. Oh, no, are we? Okay. Or you need to zoom out one of the two. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay. There we go. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, you Just were zoomed to in. Zoom out. Okay, gotcha. Oh, that's the problem with zooming in. If I start working on a different part of the painting. Yeah, just be sure to look through the viewfinder. If yeah, you, I if need you to can. look through the viewfinder. Sorry, guys. I'm not used to having a viewfinder. That's that's cool. Okay. So, uh, New York City. Oh right. yeah. Um, I, I a gallery there has invited me to do some work there, right right on Central Park. There's a lovely gallery and. I might be doing that, but probably not for a while because everything I'm working on right now is for the Corey Helfer Gallery in Los Angeles, and that is, I'm going to have to fill out the huge room by the end of February, <laughs> so I, that's what I'll be working on pretty much exclusively, other than some contract pieces and some Disney stuff and maybe some commissions now and then, but mostly I'll be working on stuff for the Los Angeles Gallery. And Glinda says that her spirit animal is a sloth. A girl with a sloth would be cute. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh, gosh. That would make Milo happy, Maddie. <laughs> he likes the sloth. Yeah. It's strange not having music. What's that? It feels strange not having music. There, there is music. Oh, I can't hear You just it. can't hear it very oh. well. <laughs> Apparently, it was at that point, it was, or it was too loud <laughs> oh, okay. um, for the room. Gotcha. What, does the music sound good in the, Put in the headphones, phone Brandon? And just dance the whole time. You can hear it. Okay, you can hear it. Okay. Would Jasmine do a May Queen fairy in the spirit of the movie Midsummer? I have a I have faces a fairy that, that looks are, pretty good. I, I do have. Um, they're previous to the film Midsummer. We're talking about that, but um, I do have a May Queen, and I do have a Midsummer um, piece I did for a, a Swedish woman, and it's a little uh, fairy with that mid Midsummer things. Do you have a link to those ones, though? Uh, Are you I, I can create them? a link. What, what do you? Which ones? May Queen and sure. uh, Faces uh, of Fairy. Yeah. What is that? Number two. I'll, I'll dig that one out. I'll, I'll just okay. find it. Okay. Um, May Queen. Come on. Um, I think that Jasmine should do the uh, cup uh, uh, painting of the couple on the rock. Oh yeah, the, for like, midsummer. I, that, do, that'd I be like cool. that. Or after they fall down. Yeah, yeah, yeah that would I be like that pretty wicked. Yeah, actually, there's a lot of things from midsummer to paint. Someone said movie. the music is in the background of the stream. Yeah. The, I it's can't relaxing hear it music. Though. Love it on the Sunday afternoon. I think that was the Okay. So. Oh, okay. To turn it up or that we we're talking about. Oh, okay, I see. Mm -hmm. And then I'm gonna find that faces of fairy. She's a cutie. The faces of fairy is really cute. Um, I like that one. Painting with my fingers. I don't know which day yet, but we're also setting up a um streaming that won't have the chat and stuff but it will be just for patreon patrons to watch throughout the week i'll be working and broadcasting just whatever i'm painting on you can just look at me and watch me paint if you like yeah we're um, we're gonna have to uh we're gonna figure that out sometime this week yeah to i'll that. post to you patreon people so basically it's we, it's yeah. kind of similar to what you're watching now except uh no audio no mat yeah no chat <laughs> yeah <laughs> So, so basically, actually, what's Jasmine up what's to? What's Jasmine up to? You can just spy on me whenever you want. And there will be, that's for you Patreon people. Yep. Any and there will be an alert sent out when that um, yep. we do that. Yep, yep. How, I'll let how you about know. that? Yep. How about that? How about that? 
Has Jasmine ever done a hippo in her work? I know I saw a recent painting with an elephant. You know, um... The elephant one's pretty cool. Actually, I'm, the other painting on my other easel is an elephant that I'm working on now right this spring. Um, hippos, I have painted... I've done a couple commissions for people that had a hippo, like one of them was a stuffed toy hippo. I had a real more realistic one, one that was a portrait of somebody with a bunch of animals. I painted a skull of a hippo in um, Priestess of Narlatotep, the um, Lovecraft piece that has a hippo skull with eyes in it. That's probably not what you're looking for. Um, that's probably really not what you're looking for. But um, no, I'm, I should do though because I've certainly seen lots of hippos in the wild. I love them. That's something I saw a heck of a lot of in Africa was hippos and baby hippos and they're just precious. For those local to here, um, the Animal Kingdom has yes. a really good hippo exhibit. Um, I really, really, that's the only way I've really felt up close to hippos at all. I didn't go on uh, a trip to Africa with Jasmine. I was goofing off with a bunch of riders. You were. <laughs> we'll go sometime. Elizabeth says, I do hippos. They're awesome. I love, love, love hippos. That's three loves. Too. That's very lovely. Did D&D &D inspire your 10 to 20 sided dice paintings jasmine yeah there are any games that use polyhedric dice i suppose but i certainly played a lot of dungeons and dragons when i was younger that's how i got into doing fantasy art actually yeah, as a kid i used to have um often use the name strangeling also <laughs> later when i played D, D like with um when i was a teenager so matt so yeah, absolutely. That probably inspires a lot of my more fantasy sort of artwork, gaming art stuff. There's also a series of figurines I designed where the um, where the fairies, the little statues, and they had different dice that they were holding, but I don't think that they ever went into production. But but I had the artwork from it, so hey. Oh oh, I didn't tell I didn't tell her about it, Leela. Um, Jasmine, there is a new um show. I forget which it's one of the Hulu's or Netflix's or millions of things that we have a subscription to. <laughs> um, yeah. Some of the TV. Yeah. Everybody I, does I, now because I, I, that's what no, you man. do. Yeah, gotcha. Uh, there's Lovecraft Country. Oh. Um, I heard that the first episode was really good. I have not seen that. But I, I don't know. I so think um, I'm excited to see it though. It's HBO Max. It's HBO. So I think, I think we're okay there. Is it? Did HBO like turn into Cinemax? Is that why it's called that? I or, don't know. Whatever. Or Cinemax even been something in the past 20 years. I don't even I know. I can't keep track of these things. Okay. Yeah, I don't really care. Yeah. I've seen an Alice in Wonderland painting before, but would you also do one of the versions from Alice Madness Returns game? Is that, um, is is that, that American, a, McGee? American McGee? Is that like the video games? If so, then no, I can't do that. That belongs to American McGee. Yeah, we, yeah, I feel we, like if you asked him... Hey, why don't you do a Jasmine painting? Right, we can't. <laughs> no, American McGee though is up at Patreon. He's up, yeah, up if you at want, Patreon. if you want a painting of his, you can go ask him for one. He's super nice, I think. So, Color out of spaces. Right. The is that the first one? Really? I love no, Cal I'm, Color I'm, out of space. No, Blob Help has that as a question. Oh, I, I know the really? story. Really? That would be a good one. To, I mean, I'm I'd be interested to see how they. Yeah, turn I, I want to see how but... you would visually do that. Maybe people. Yeah, what maybe their reactions. What color would they use? I, <laughs> I mean, don't know. it can be a color people could see. Ooh, uh, I like that. Max Schwartz says, I love your Alice and Dolly piece. So many oh, references in the painting. Yes. Yeah. Now, see, that one was okay to do. Because yes, it's, that uh, okay it's to do. out of a... Uh, that was one that yeah. not only was it yeah in public domain, it was I also checked with the Dolly, um, what are, the Folk. foundation, whoever the people are that run the museum. So. Yeah, Alice Madness Returns, I think, is the sequel. Yeah, that that's American McGee's, and yeah, he's got a Patreon sure. making his artwork. I certainly don't want to steal from him. No, no, with Disney, I can do Disney ones for Alice because Disney hires me to do the Disney Alice ones. So that's that's those ones. And then there's Alice, which is just from um, Lewis Carroll, which is in public domain. But you can't use Disney's Alice or American McGee's Alice unless you get permission or contract from them. Oh, Jasmine. Yeah. Uh, Shoopaloop says, I wanted to thank uh, Jasmine for having a long conversation with me. Oh. 
at FerryCon in Hunt Valley, Maryland oh, several for years ago. Sakes. She uh-huh. gave me a bunch of great advice for my career and oh. it um, been so beneficial. She's a true gem. Oh, thank you very much. Makes me happy. Did <laughs> people remember back then? We had some fun times out at that show. I remember going to some good restaurants too. Yeah, they have a neat supermarket there. Uh huh. They have a. Oh yeah, the one in Hunt Valley has a giant Wegmans across from it. So Leela says that uh, she and Nigel are watching uh, Lovecraft Country. Oh cool. I have to check that out. I'm. I like me some Lovecraft. Remember, one of the last paintings I think I did up here was uh. Did I work on that one? Um. Innsmouth Mermaid. Yeah. Was it? I forget. Innsmouth? I don't remember. Innsmouth Mermaid? I remember Innsmouth Mermaid. I don't remember it being on Twitch, but maybe. Did I paint it on Twitch? I I don't know. I did, because I remember talking about Lovecraft because I was reading that biography about him. And what a a jerk he was. Yeah, that's a thing. I remember talking about it. (laughs) Yeah, he apparently wasn't the best person. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, I was just trying to, I was saying that's how I remember I was working on it here, I think. But you don't need to be I a good person to have good artwork. No, I wasn't going to talk crap on him. Ah, okay. <laughs> I was just saying that um, I was trying to remember whether I was painting that live or not. Yep. Kazumaka says it was definitely on Twitch. Well, yep. You guys would remember. I don't remember. Yeah, I was going to say, somebody who actually who was watching would remember more than we would because we just I, I was here the whole time either way. Oh, that. Jasmine, this is going to... Fuchsia Moon Girl says, will Jasmine be touring again with Robin Hitchcock? Oh. I saw him last in 1989 in Orlando. He oh. was amazing. I I my I very well might be. So I I I I'll have to have to check with Robin yeah, and Emma. Um, but Emma, his wife or his partner. We just got is, her new album. Yeah, I just got her album, and she is kicking so much ass. She is the number two best-selling Australian musical artist currently this week, and she's like in the top ten for album. She's got number one country album and number um one vinyl also so yeah and i just got a record her name is emma swift yeah so glinda asked how long does it take to complete a painting um ooh, that's a very good question it depends a lot on the painting and if i'm working on a bunch of paintings at the same time like right now i have probably five paintings i'm kind of working on so it's not if i said like a year because i work on it a couple weeks every day for or every month for five months or something but i would say probably about 70 hours for something about this size this is a 16 by 20 it's going to be fairly detailed but not insanely detailed there's going to be some large areas of negative space so um yeah probably about 50 to 70 hours on a 16 by 20. i'm paying a lot <laughs> once i get my um weekday cam up and you can just spy on me painting that you will see how much i i paint it's kind of crazy jasmine yeah how did you start doing paintings for Disney? Did they recognize you or did you reach out to Disney? Oh, they recognize they came to me. As far as I know, Disney comes to you. <laughs> I don't I don't I haven't heard anybody else having the other experience, but you never know. Um yeah, the, there were several people at Disney who collected my work and were fans of my artwork and I had done concept art and projects with Disney that were co-branded back in the mid 2000s with um, the Bradford Exchange and um, one of the creative directors at Disney has been buying my artwork since I was like 20, <laughs> like a very long time. And they, yeah, they had me sign a contract first and then they talked to me and I've done a lot of work with the company in various, various ways and various more ways to be coming. Jasmine, do you yeah. like Nick Cave? I do. And Bad, bad Seeds? Yeah. Yep, yeah. But, yeah. I, I like you some Nick Cave. Why? Uh, Fuchsia Moon Girl's asking. Oh, Yeah. Probably like if you like this, you like this. Uh, yeah, exactly. If Uh-oh, you like Jasmine, you may like <laughs> Nick Cave. Right, Sunshine? <laughs> yeah. And you he get did. a sunshine. He did a sunshine Himmel sticker for Berlin. that. Huh? You get a sunshine sticker. Yeah. Oh, so now people are talking about Nick Cave in the room. <laughs> What about Nick Cage? Not the same thing. Not the same thing. Not the same thing as Nick Cage. Okay. All right. I mean, I know that the uh, the girls are all about Nick Cage. (laughs) Some of them. Could you put a link in the chat for all the new people? A link in the chat. For what? Oh, Karen is asking. Um, I'll have to look for it. 
for his uh, YouTube. Oh, okay. Let's see if I can find it. Yeah, hopefully. We have not tried um, exporting this new um, broadcasting thing to YouTube yet, but hopefully it will work, Kieran. If it does, then um, probably tomorrow or so we'll have the archive of this episode to be put onto the YouTube. Because uh, for those who want to catch up on old episodes, um, you can look at YouTube. I'm Jasmine Beckett up there. And as I always say, Beckett has one T, B-E-C-K-E-T, Jasmine Beckett. And you look at me on YouTube, and oh, you I, can I do see have my it here. old episodes. I found it. And, like, if you miss one, you can look and see it, usually the day after we record one. I won't think, I'm not going to do that with just the streaming broadcast, though, that I'm doing for Patreon. That doesn't seem, <laughs> there's no audio, I'm not going to Kazumaka says, one of my twin daughters is terrified of Nicolas Cage. <laughs> that's a, you that's, know it'd be that's scary awesome. if he like lived next door or something. It's not like <laughs> they, they mean him as an actor. Now Blob Help says he's more of a Johnny Cage fan. Uh, that's a reference to um, Mortal Kombat I think. I'm trying to see if I missed anything. Um Rage Pixie says that's kind of like hyper focusing. A lot of artists do what you just get sucked into your work. Do that. You just get sucked into your work. Yeah. Um, I did when I was uh, did graphics. I'd get days that I just bleed into each other. Yeah. Days that bleed into each other. I'd emerge from my cave. Yeah. <laughs> and cuddly, it's cave and, and cuddly. It's some suddenly maybe it's Wednesday. Probably. Probably and I need to get suddenly. lectures, even though I was uh, sure to, it was still Saturday. Ah, uh, yeah, that can. Uh, that Those sort are of alpha stuff waves. Happens to me so much now that like it doesn't matter what day it is anymore. Will hardly. Jasmine work on this same painting next week, or will it be a new painting? I don't know. Also, too, if I start streaming during the week now, too, for Patreon, I might um, get this done faster. I don't know because I'm tomorrow. I'm going to be working on a Disney piece, so I'm not going to be able to broadcast that. Um. I might be. If it's not finished, I very likely might be working on this piece still. Let me see. If, I'm trying to see if I can show you more of, of this part. I've, it's one from a sketch I did when I was six, so I um, have transferred it onto a big panel. Start off as pencil sketched. It's going to have Paulo and um, Hyacinth back there, like from the um, Louis de Bologna painting. And she's going to have a bunch of flowers in her lap. I've got her holding a Roman vase. And I'm going to have a bunch of hyacinth flowers, like these ones here. I'm going to be painting those. What color will they be? They'll be blue. Oh, okay. Just Actually, um, the hyacinth blue ranges anywhere from like periwinkle to indigo to violet almost. So it's really a wide range of blue. But I'm going to have a wide range of blues in the painting, which is part of the reason I went with a more warm, neutral ground for the gesso paint. Jasmine? Yeah. Uh Fuchsia says, thank you, uh, Jasmine and Maddie, so very much for oh, sharing course. your time and talents with us. Thank you. You're very welcome. You're very, very welcome. Uh, Angela welcome wants to know, there. any idea what will be the next portrait set? Did you just change your name, Angela? Uh, any idea what the next uh, portrait set? Uh, pins, Yeah. Oh, I, I do. The next part, the mini metal portrait set's a little square pins. It's going to be a Halloween um, set. So that was that will probably mean it's coming out like in... September, early October, I think. Is that right, Mandy? Ish? Sure. Okay. <laughs> All um, right. L L I don't know. Brandon and I will be working on it. Okay. Brandon's like, well, yay. You like those. Brandon and Matt are like, no, Jasmine's not sets, making those anymore. No. <laughs> Brandon's just staring at me. He's like, <laughs> no. They, um, I love it, though, when people are like, I had a little bit of trouble getting this one pin off the back and like, we just did this. We just we put just them on like over seven million of times. these on. It's, yes. So, but I but I understand. I know. I know. Maybe I you just do it once in a while. Yes. It's like ow. Yeah. Five hundred and one day. Five hundred and one day. day. Mm, yeah. Good. Better That's you than me, dude. Good. L hurts. <laughs> L hurts says, "Can we get a hint on the Disney piece? Pretty please." Um. Let's see. Well, the one that I have finished that I've finished I, that's gotten approval is um. One of uh, probably the most famous Disney character. I wonder who that is. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> no, no, don't, I, don't I can't tell anything. you. But... <laughs> Shut up, Brandon. Shut up, Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> but, no, okay. don't say anything. I did something in audio, I think. Oh, okay. Oh, well, okay. good. Good. I'm, I'm happy. How many? 
how many paintings does Jasmine work on at once? Um, She's got two paintbrushes in her feet right now. I do have two paintbrushes on my feet right now. No, um, I have, well, right now I think I have four or five in the works, but two of them are Disney. One of them is really big, so it's on my big easel. Um, then I think I've got some mini piece I'm working on, too. So I guess five. But usually I just have one or two. But the problem is, too, I've got, like, two half-finished pieces right now at my studio in England because I haven't been there since last um, last year. <laughs> and I have, like, two pieces oh, that are partway good. finished no, in my it. studio in Kansas City because I haven't been there since last year. So I don't even re I don't remember what I was no, working you're, you're on, good. really. I've, I know I've got, like, a half-finished... I think it's, like, Darling Dragonling number six somewhere. <laughs> Jasmine, do you sand yeah. after Gesso? What's that? Do you sand after gesso? I don't because I actually want the gesso to... I actually am doing it with a brush so that it makes tooth. The only time I will sand it is if I get like a weird line or like those weird clumpy things that come like from dried paint that are inside the top of the gesso or like flecks of plaster or whatever they are. If, if there's like a bump, I, I will sand it off. I have like a thousand grit sandpaper in here somewhere. But normally I don't. I just brush it, do a layer, brush it. It, it, then it kind of looks like canvas almost. I'm not trying to get it perfectly smooth. I, I use too much kind of dry brushing and finger painting to. Do you have extra want pin backs smooth. in case we lose one, or is there a place we can buy them from? Um, that's a question for just. Uh, yeah, email Matt at yep. strangeling.com. And um, we are going to soon be adding um, the, the actual cardboard backings that are autographed by me. We're going to start having those up on the website to purchase the cheap, like a dollar. I'm not going to charge money for my signature. Just because we haven't been able to do conventions and not, um, I haven't been able to autograph things for anybody. So I'm going to have some blank pin backs, like the board backing boards available, like a set of 10 of them for whatever a cheap print is. I don't know when we're going to be adding that, but that way you can get some signed pin back. So since you haven't been able to come to any shows, for right? Like a lot of months. people will have you, yeah, sign them. So. Yeah, yeah. Usually people are like, "Will you sign my pin back?" And I'm right. Like, yeah. So this way you can just, I'll sign it and you can pop it on yourself. Your art is sprinkled in all your studios. It is, of Bianca. It is so much. It's so ridiculous. Yeah, you're right, Blob. What is it? Uh, Blob is saying 500 times 8, 4,000 painful pinbacks. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yep. We got to hurt for it. One time I did them all by myself. I remember the first one, the first set of the mini metal pin, pin sets, I did all of those myself. What happened at the Ren Fair, Jasmine? Did anything get recovered? Was the thief caught? As far as I know, Thief was not caught, nor do I think they're really looking for him. Um, apparently, they've been living in my house for a while when I wasn't there, which creeps me out. And I, the I little Renfair get, house, not our Renfair house, yeah, yeah. Not, it, not my personal house. I'm in it, but um, yeah, it sucked. People broke into it and trashed the whole thing. Um, my father and my uncle um, have been fixing it up, but of course, the Renfair is not open now this season, so we'll have everything all fixed up and ready to go by 2021 so we're already planning on that because nobody totally. will be at the Ren fair this year it is creepy it is um fuchsia says will jasmine paint any more arcamboldo pieces yes um she's one of my absolute faves and would she ever paint anything featuring Lewis Comfort Tiffany or Renee Lalique influences. Ooh, glass art. Yes and yes. Yeah, totally. There's the um, Tiffany. There's a Tiffany Museum. They have the Tiffany Cathedral at the Morse Museum here at Winter Park. I, I really like beautiful glass, so that would be that would be something to make. I did a co-brand for the Tif the current version of the Tiffany Company. Um, they had me. I think they did like some fairies of mine that like had wings that were stained glass, but. I don't remember if it was like limited edition, but it wasn't something that wasn't available to the public. But you can find them probably maybe somewhere. But what was the question I asked before that? Too? Oh, Arkham Yes, yeah. yes. I have a an Arkham piece 
that at least one that will probably be at my Enigma show at the Corey Halford Gallery at the same show as this. So that'll be something you'll probably be watching me paint over the next few months. Why is that Nintendo guy? Why is your all your text highlighted? Because he's fancy. Probably just. Can you choose your own font or whatever? You could pick background. I don't know. With a lot of us being in quarantine and whatnot, what guilty pleasure on TV or books did everyone watch? Or oh, he's just asking. Oh, that. that's a good conversation. Um, I uh, I fell prey to Tiger King. I watched that. Um, let's see. I watched, watched a lot of true crime. I watched a lot of true crime. <laughs> I I listened um, to a lot of podcasts. I watched a lot of Rick and Morty. Yeah. Like a lot of Rick Bob's and Morty. Bob's Burgers. Yeah. Um, watched some good stuff on TV. I, I usually don't really fall prey to guilty pleasures that much. I, I usually try to watch something good if I'm going to take the time to watch TV. Usually. Ozark. I watched that. Yeah, Grinchy. Yeah, Ozark. We watched... We oh yeah, that. that was good. That is actually really good. That was good. And We're from Missouri uh, too. So yeah, it's kind I'm of from Missouri. Watch. So, yeah. and there is a Kansas City mob. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> and they kind of, I, I imagine that they. Uh, Let's not talk oh, about you, them too much. You can redeem channel points for highlighted text. Interesting. Oh, that makes your your text show up better than it. That's hilarious. I'm binging rain like. R E I G N. I haven't seen that. I don't know it either. I watched Dark was really good, the German show. Yeah, I saw a lot of people. I didn't did watch it, but Jasmine. Oh, did. you didn't watch it. I liked it. Oh, someone said whoop whoop, and, they, and now they have a uh, highlighted text too. Ah. Green Goddess and Soft Shell are my absolute Green favorite Goddess. paintings you've ever done. Oh, Green Goddess is one of my. Jasmine favorites. likes those too. Oh, those are you have good taste. They're also the person who likes Robin Hitchcock. Oh, well, hell. Yeah. <laughs> you can also make custom options for channel points. Oh. Ah, that starts to drive me crazy. Uh, sounds com complicated. <laughs> but, if you, I mean, if that's something that you guys want. That's true. We don't know very much about time. how Twitch works. Very good. Huh? Oh, uh, uh, Brandon figured out, or he got a little command in the room that you uh -oh. can. He was seeing how long we've been broadcasting for. Oh. Does it tell us how long? No, that's okay. So you type an exclamation up time and it, and it says how long we've been broadcasting. How long does it say? Uh, hour and 53. Oh, wow. We started early yeah. with the uh, streaming soon thingy. Oh, the, the Firefly thingy? Yep. Mm -hmm. Is that camera? That's camera. Mm -hmm. Just when you thought it was safe to mm -hmm. go back in the bathroom. <laughs> Jasmine said nothing. She said nothing. Instead, we heard this. Yeah, that, that's that going to be Jasmine's uh, bleep button. I should get one. Oh. Hey, Jasmine, try no. to uh, try to mouth the ow sound. One, two, three, go. I wonder if it'll it look like it. I don't know. I tried it. I think I did. Too Tell me if it looks like it on there. I, I did it twice. I think it nah, like I don't it. know if it. I don't know if it lined I up or not. I don't think so. <laughs> a nanos. Oh darn it! Bad dubbing, Jasmine. Bad I'm sorry. dubbing. Oh, my career is a voice dubber. <laughs> Fuchsia likes kitties, but allergic. Oh, I would be so sad. I love well, my babies. Robin Hitchcock has lots of cats. <laughs> he does. <laughs> Well, not lots. That, that's by really the way, guys. That's a that's an artist that a musical artist that Jasmine very much likes. He's also likes. A, he's also a painter. He's a good painter. But yeah, he's a fun. My guilty read night right now is Midnight Sun. Please don't judge me. Midnight Sun. Oh, that is that a is that a Twilight? I don't know. Is it, oh, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh wait, are those like no? Those are all nighttime things, aren't they? I've been watching YouTube videos of people Twilight? going to flea markets and trash picking. I miss boot sales. <laughs> oh, Aw, sorry. Hey, man, I've gotten some. Hey, good maybe we'll see you next British year and up in uh, Glastonbury. I, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of Jones. And... to go to England. I want to see what paintings I was working on. I'm afraid of Kansas City. I know I left stuff in the fridge, and I haven't been there like a year. <laughs> the Becca's been watching a lot of Twitch. Oh. Twitch. 
Such a weird name. It is. So, um, for those of you who just joined the chat or whatever, um, if you type in exclamation raffle, uh, you can join the the raffle for the Butterflies and Bones pin. It oh, is yeah. the pin of the month mm. this month, August. And I'll put a link there, too. You can oh. also purchase it now. If you're oh, not yeah, a Patreon a, member, you can just buy it. Now, That's so. always an option. Yeah. And I will find it. I think it's too dark when I put things here. I don't know, dude. Was that the way that maybe that's how you used to do yeah, it? Yeah, I used to do it with the other camera, but it, the other camera had like, it was light. I'll so. pop in a link for yeah. Butterflies and Bones. She's really pretty. That blue is very, very pretty. Yeah, it's it's hard to show. Darn it. Yes, uh, Brandon and I like the blue. Because it's boy. Okay, I binge so. watch West Coast Customs on Netflix. Coast. Is that like a motorcycle show or something? Or is it like government customs, like having to bring in stuff from different countries? I, I, I don't like that show if that's what it is. I, I will like not watch taxes it. taxes and having to pay on... Does your fridge have a box of baking soda in it? Yeah. In Kansas City? Oh, I was saying about how oh, I hadn't been to my house there oh, for um, a what, year. We have family that can and clean I have it out. Stuff. I don't think I've told him to clean out the fridge, though. Have you? Have you told anybody there to? No, like, I just want to chuck that thing anyway. Yeah. I don't like it. I don't like that fridge either. It's not. It's a. It's not a bad good fridge. fridge. No, and I, I really like our fridge here in Florida. This house. Do you have a favorite Robin Hitch, um, cock song? Mine is "Let There Be More Darkness." Oh. Aye, golly gee. Which one do you sing really loud and out of tune all the time? All of them? Don't, you stole my punchline. Oh, sorry. I don't know, dude. Which You would probably know, Matt, which is my favorite Robin Hood. Oh, I like Raymond and uh, the a- Ask her on a Sunday, it's different than on a Tuesday. It's like asking her what her favorite painting it of is. her own is. Okay. I'm, I'm going to say Raymond and the Wires. You know what? I, I would say that that would pre- be a pretty good guess on my part if I would have guessed that. Okay. Um, it's one of the you, best songs that one seems to be in. more emotional for you. Oh, a, a very, a very good, uh, That's a good, song. good song for Jasmine. We uh, will be there at Glastonbury. Okay, Karen's saying we'll be there. Well, we won't be there. Uh, like, are you, like in five minutes? <laughs> no, if if they have Glastonbury, no, I'm just joking, will... Karen. It'll be great to see you. Yeah, no, if 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 they have it, I will be there. <laughs> so Brandon, but... who's a, a fan of Arthurian legend, really wants to go to Glastonbury sometime. Oh yeah. So maybe if he's really good, <laughs> we might let him tag along. We might let Brandon come. Actually, um, that might be really helpful. Dude, anywhere in the UK, you'd enjoy it. Yeah. It's it's great. It's great for an American to go to because it, everything's everything is different. Yeah. And lovely and good sandwiches. My gosh. Oh my god, the sandwiches. Our sandwiches in Vegetarians America. Vegetarians are. I mean, lucky I love our public subs, too. but so dang, the sandwiches food. in the UK are just primo. Yeah. The best sandwiches. The grammar is a lot better. So the ratings. <laughs> Doesn't take much. I don't know. It depends on who you talk to. I've it, seen some. It, there are a lot of out, out of the there. I'm like, my gosh, I should. In not. England, like they are in America, where sometimes it's harder to understand. Uh, Art of Bianca says public subs for life. It, here, definitely, but yeah, I'm public telling you, subs, Bianca. Dang, yeah. My gosh, the sandwiches are good there. They are. I don't know if it's the bread or what. They just put so much care into it. They put. They choose quality prod, uh, quality ingredients. It's so darn yeah. fresh. But I would say that's the cool thing about the Publix. Yeah, Publix. Well, do you like do you Publix like public sandwiches, uh, Brandon? You like them? It's they're better good. than Subway, isn't it? Yeah, you like they're, one. They're, they are better than Subway. You like the chicken tender thingy? Yeah, Brandon's a, probably like a, he rolls his eyes at me because, as you a, all know here, I'm a vegetarian and I don't know a lot about meat. It's, it's not gonna sound decadent, but I get oh, the okay. tofu avocado. But Brandon has a lot of uh, friends at school that are also that are vegan and whatnot. Mm. Do you ever show in Liverpool? Show what? That's. I'm sorry. I'd love to actually. We need to end this. I very much love to go. <laughs> Emergency. So, yeah. um, would you no, Would you do house, a show in Liverpool? Flat in the UK, and I use it as a, I'd say secondary studio, but like tertiary studio. I've been on there for a while. But um, I so Liverpool is not far. 
We think everything is not far in England because we're used to being in, kin or, you know, Florida through California and stuff. But um, we, um, we'd love to. I don't know if there's events there. They have a Comic Con that happens. Um, yeah. They have stuff. Yeah. I'd love, yeah. To, I'd, I'd love to go there anyways. Oh, don't forget so the fun. Mounties, Jasmine. Uh, exactly. So, uh, Bounty. oh, I don't know if Brandon would like them, though, because he doesn't like coconut. He doesn't like coconut. Bounties are, are like are, really good hob mounds. Nobs. Hob nobs is good. Oh, you, I don't think you'd like them. I love them though. You need to bring Brandon to Wales. Yeah, Kazumaka is pro Wales. She is. I'd like to go to. I'd like to go There's to Mount Snowden. There's dragons there. Big huh? old red dragons. Yes, yeah, red dragons. Brandon can go see Whitby Abbey. Actually, uh, I I showed him it on like the. Uh, oh, it's it's it is the lovely. internet. Sure and uh, he thought it looked really cool. It's really no, cool. Me the, uh, a, a tour. tour. Yes, the pandemic, <laughs> pandemic digital, digital tour. tour. Just, don't you wish you'd be? It's Abbey. like I've never been there before, so I don't know what I'm missing. Yeah. But yeah, Whitby Abbey is amazing. Whitby Abbey was around before America was even colonized. That's true. Or I don't pronounce it that way, but yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm getting frisky over here. I yeah, can see. I can see Snowdon. From my living room window, the whole oh Snowdonia gosh. mountain range. Really? Cool, oh, Kazumaka. that's badass. That's awesome. That's pretty nifty. I like that. We Florida is so flat. I love mountains. I like, but I like flat. I love too. our swamps. I because love Florida. The cool thing about Florida, and I try to have to, I, have I have mountains. to remind Brandon sometimes what's good in Florida because he was <laughs> raised here. Yeah. So he thinks like other places are more mysterious and have variation, etc. Yeah. And I just have to remind him what a beautiful sky we have. <laughs> When you, oh, we do have good skies here in Florida. That's true. So, but it's it's a common thing to not like where you were raised. That's true. I, I've a lot noticed of people that move to Florida or move, and then yeah. they sometimes move back. Yeah. So, I I can't argue with it. Yeah, there's good places all over. I know this was most likely mentioned earlier, but what is sure. the date for the Corey Helford Gallery Show? Yeah. I know it went back and forth a couple times. Yeah. Currently, they, they had uh, currently it is February scheduled for February twenty seventh. February 27th. It's supposed to hang for, I think, five weeks or six weeks or something, but I'll be there for the opening February 27th, assuming that it hasn't been postponed for travel restrictions or anything like that. So. Uh, plus, oh, Cosmic says, plus we also have a lot of Arthurian history. The real true... Yeah. <gasps> Gates? Gates to Camelot. Okay. Ah. Yeah, they miss... That was a unfortunate misspelling. Yeah. Uh, yes, I thought about moving away from Orlando, but the skies make all the negatives worth it. Oh, I'm not the only one. Oh, the skies are lovely. Uh, Jijoki Mom says, I was raised in Illinois, took my daughter in March where everything was gray. She said it felt like death. I agree. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, um, I will say that the, the, Midwest, the winters the Midwest, during, so. yeah, the winters, the, the trees not having any leaves. Yeah. The bleakness, Bleak the uh, farmland. potential of seasonal affective disorder, yeah. etc. cetera snow it's ice not storms. appealing to me midwest and darn ice storms that's what i can't buy i'll take a hurricane no one chooses to live in florida people just end up here all the crazies roll <laughs> down downhill and pools in florida all the crazy rolls downhill and pools in florida shoot that's why we Might have pools <laughs> that's why we all have pools so we that can is. catch them yes montana has that big sky it needs to be a flat place. It Montana has, has the potential to see the... Uh, you have mountains sometimes um, in Montana. <laughs> I think that... I mean, I've heard rumors. I don't know. Yeah. That Montana has the potential to see the Aurora Borealis, but I'm not sure. My dad says that he saw it in Minnesota when He, he says was when he was kid. little, right? When he was a kid. That he used to be able to see the um, Aurora Borealis in America more, <laughs> other than in Australia or Alaska. I don't know. I don't know either. Could I've be. never seen it. I live in South Florida and love it, says Mary Kay. Yeah, I love Florida. I like Florida too. Oh, I like I like having houses in because other I know what the alternative too. is. I travel a lot, and I do have multiple residences, sort of. So it's true. You, uh, Boston area. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's cool. I hate that in one day Kansas yeah, can go through four seasons. Yeah, yeah, it it goes from cold to. Whatever. A comet. I didn't see any comet. When? 
Kazumaka says, did you see the comment? No. A comment now? I have no idea. Like, recently? That's a loaded question. I need more info. I saw Haley's comment. Alaska is like beautiful. In... My dad lived up there for a few years, and I visited him. Oh. I'd love to go up to, uh, all the way up to Alaska on a cruise. That... I'd, I'd like I've been to up to Canada Alaska. on a cruise, and that's about uh, the most know. north I've been. Yeah. Vancouver. Wasn't that the most north over there, Jasmine? Vancouver? Vancouver. I'm trying to think. We went to Victoria. Victoria seems is, around the same. It's all kind of around the water. I'm trying to remember which. We went via boat, so we're kind of all up. So The northern lights emit I this beautiful sounding hum. Literally, there's a hum? Yeah, that's, magnetic. That's hum. creepy. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I don't trust that. People shouldn't trust the northern lights. I mean, I, I, I want to see it, yeah. but it seems like something we, I mean, do people worship it? I mean, that's kind of They look freaky. pretty magic. Yeah. I've done a cruise to Alaska. It was absolutely beautiful. Huh? Oh. Crispy Alaska. critter. That's nice. See, we went from making people hungry uh -huh. to making people want to travel. Ah. I bet you're hungry, aren't you, dude? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I am <laughs> hungry, too. We, we, we were, have, we were so busy house. setting up the Twitch stuff, we, we just forego lunch. And I literally have the worst house to offer anybody food. From. I was like, do you I want an apple or some dinosaur juice. kale? We have apples, raw dinosaur kale. I ended up and giving them a peanut butter, I coconut. I had a raw vegan peanut treat. butter cookie. You make it sound like a cat. Hey, I treats. eat treats all the they time. They are treats. They're I do have, like I've got cat treats if treats. you want. I mean, there's that, that's your meat. Yeah, yeah, you eat meat. You eat cat food. A cat treat, right? <laughs> but Same stuff. Brandon is uh, he likes he likes trying out the uh, vegetarian the meats stuff. a lot. Uh, yeah, they're fun. And uh, we've we went to uh, Burger King and got the the uh, Impossible Whopper, and that was a lot of fun. And did Brandon like it? Yes. The cookies are good, actually. The um ones we get. Yeah, they're. I saw them at excellent. Publix. I really the good. heck out of them. Comet Neo Wise. That's the name of it. It's kind of cool. What a cool oh yeah, name. I just I showed uh, I showed you the Matrix recently. Yeah, Brandon Wait. had not seen the Matrix. Was that one that you were um, suggesting people watch? That was one I would suggest if you hadn't seen it. Oh. You should see it just for the memes alone. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Some movies are important to watch so you can tell when people are making fun of them and referencing. Them. Okay, that Nintendo guy. That's Jason, context. by the way. Yeah. You remember Jason? Um, that Nintendo guy says Starbucks Impossible Breakfast Sandwich is great. Oh. Oh, it passed by in June, the comet. Oh, shoot. No, probably... How did I not know about that? I, I suck. Was probably, I probably missed it because I was reading astrology. Probably. Yeah, the, the, the <laughs> astrology, the, the fake the astronomy. astronomy. Yeah. Well, I knew what phase of the moon we were in, though. Yeah, Mercury was in retrograde. Does Jasmine... Ever... Did Jasmine ever visit any of the Walt Disney World parks? Um, we we oh, yeah. are uh, we are pass holders. We just haven't visited uh, lately because of the virus yeah. and my own illness. But yeah, but yeah, in general, we do. We go to um, all over. Oh, I, I have galleries in oh, uh, California and Florida at Disney World and the Wonder well, Wonder what I can do, I think I can end it Disney, Disney Spring. to make it. Then for fun, I, can pick we, I like out. going and taking people, nieces and nephews, the and things to Disneyland Tokyo, Disneyland Paris. I think I will. Have not been to Shanghai or Hong Kong Disney yet. But. Hey Jasmine, I think yeah. um I'm I'm off. Uh, I was off oh. starting it, but I'm gonna p go ahead and pick the winner for the five o'clock now. Oh okay, sure. So let's see what happens. Oh, it won't let me, dude. <gasps> it's hovering over it. I have to wait till the timer goes down. Oh. <laughs> look at that. You have to wait oh, you exactly until it's like that minute well, or what? No more fans. No, that that would kill it, right? No, it doesn't kill it. Oh, now I pick a winner. Yep. Okay, I see. It's working. Okay. All right, so I'm going to pick a winner. And okay. Brittany Rothman, 33. Oh, and they are the winner of the um, Butterflies and Bones pin. Yep, and I'll stick my little message in there. Thank you, sir. Yay. May I have another? Okay. So they have won that one. And then the last prize... We'll be in is this hour. the and cool spinning wheel? And I'll, I'll preview that again. Yeah, we won't just, know what it is. To show you it won't make people enter it. Right, right, right. They will enter it, but I but pick. It'll make sense, sweetie. Okay, well, I don't I don't see what you're doing. So uh, I'm going to Go. show you guys what the spinning wheel looks like because this is cool. This is um. In an hour, we're going to do this cool nifty spinning wheel thing. Uh huh. And then we find out who won, or 
what they won. Yeah, and I'm going to start this raffle in just a minute here. Oh, okay. So they, that person, in, in theory, if we would do this from an hour, and I spun it, the random thing this time, and this is the, probably not going to happen, ended on a 10 by 10 canvas. Oh, hey. So that's pretty cool. But I'm going to start that raffle. Okay. So you guys will need to rejoin after I click this button over here. Okay. And we, you won't know your prize until you know if you won. And you might win an original painting, apparently. And I'm going to start... Apparently that's an option. Start this giveaway. And let's see if how, how that looked in the chat. A prize wheel giveaway. Woo! So everybody do the exclamation raffle, and there is a really <laughs> slim chance you could win an original painting. <laughs> and then immediately sell it. I guess I'll have to paint one, yeah. <laughs> Or something. I, no, I'll find a little one. If, dude, if that happens, uh-huh. I think I'll just. Oh, I'm calling it a. Matt will, I'll call Matt it a will week. act like you got disconnected. <laughs> yep. No, you have to do it. I'll hold you to it. No, you're not the one who has to paint it. Camera? <laughs> Where's Camera? <laughs> Where is Camera, anyway? Uh, that fat. Oh, uh, that, that. I mean, the very slim cat. Oh, poor Gammy. She's gotten do you, large um, in quarantine. Remember kitty time, guys? Yeah, I can go grab Gammy. Is she? I could get her for you. Yeah, I was gonna. Do you want me? You want to take a break? Yeah, I'll take a quick break. We're gonna take a quick break, guy. Keep um. And I'll, I might keep joining Gammy. the raffle. Yeah. I'm gonna do our little standby. Yeah.
Go. Go. I got her. I got Gammy. <laughs> I got my Gamera. Ah, oh, there we go. She has gotten so fat. Oh. Yeah. Let's see. She's good though. She's not being bitey right now because she just <laughs> woke up. She has gotten so big, but she's a good girl. <laughs> Excellent. She's not being bitey at all. That's for that. I like that. She's been. <laughs> is it making camera pictures? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it, I, it worked out pretty well. <laughs> Looks just like her. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so silly. Ah, dang it. Give me a second. Yeah, yeah, your soda. Oh, no, gosh. Good, dude. All... Are you so, oh, your soda pop. No, oh, gotcha. Yep. There you go, babes. <laughs> you just put some cat fur in your soda pop. Are you good now? Yeah, okay. now, now I am. Oh, All right, gosh. I just need to really drink it with the cat fur. Okay, so I'm starting to work she, on the eyes. No, she hasn't, um, well, actually, I was going to say she hasn't bit me in a long time. She hasn't bit me badly. No, I haven't gotten a, like a, a couple weeks from her for a while. Yeah, yeah but she, bit she bites me, really me a couple um, weeks ago, but not she's for bit, like She recently. bit me this morning. Yeah, well, she, there. I don't think there's a day that goes by where she doesn't bite me. She is but, pretty cute. But yeah, she's a good girl. Other than the biting, she hasn't growled so much. She's been getting along better with her sister kitties too. Yes. Oh, that's cute, coming. April. I like that little kitty icon. I wonder if that's is that a built-in one or is that from another? Oh, Angela says she loves Gam. Oh. Gammy, gam, gam. Gammy, gammy. Thank you. Rhymes with jam. Gammy and gammy. But sometimes I'll say gammy and Jasmine will run down instead of the cat. <laughs> I'm like, she goes, like, what do you want? I'm like, yeah, I was talking to the cat. Gammy. I'm starting to draw in her eyes a bit more here. Actually, if I do that, I can see a little bit soon. I'll remember to zoom out after. Yeah, I'm interested to see uh, what the what the prize wheel prize will be. Yeah. Oh, that looked cool. You zoomed in. Yeah, I was gonna work on the eyes. So. That that's really nice. The resolution on <laughs> that on my screen looks really good, Jasmine. Oh, okay, cool. I think this is superior to what we had is before. It? Okay. Yeah, I think you I uh, Nen, and I doubt yet, so. I doubt Nen's watching, but Nen, Nen, um, Nen suggested this, this camera, the camera like five years like ago or something. Forever ago. <laughs> yeah. So we finally hooked it up. We did yeah. have it before. We just Jasmine yeah, I bought I, it back when Nun told me about it. I was like, oh, that is yeah. Jasmine and I usually get to a comfortable spot, and then we think whatever we have currently is okay. And then yeah, we need to learn how to innovate more. <laughs> What's up with the points to the side, Matt? I have no idea. The what? What points? What's up with the plus the, points? What's that? I that's. Uh, do you know what? It, so you know what it is? Can you? Could you? Um, okay, so Brandon. All I know is what I've discovered. Like from today. Apparently, you can uh, redeem them for yeah. bizarre oh. things like highlighting your text. Do you I, get them for participating or for just, chatting? Just watching. Just watching? Oh, okay. That's cool. Oh, okay. Cool. Neat. Well, um, I guess uh, you can use use that. Um, yeah. I think it's a camera. It looks like Jasmine is painting with both hands. Oh. Oh, because it's upside down. Wait, is it upside, upside down? down? No. Oh, okay. Okay, I don't know then. Well, I, I, I do paint with both hands. <laughs> oh, you know what, dude? It is it is flipped is horizontal? Because we've had to flip it. So it looks like she's painting left handed. Oh, I do sometimes. Uh, oh, that's so cool. Oh. Jasmine's well, actually painting then? with her right hand. Well, maybe I... is the picture flipped then also? <laughs> yeah. So it's the mirror of what it should be? I... I don't want it to be backwards. Guess so. It looks back. Is it can we Can we flip it yet again? Yeah, but I need to do that after. Okay. okay. Well, we'll fix that next well, time, guys. Well, this matters less because I'm just working on her face. And... But no, a good... Well, I, it's funny because I didn't... I didn't notice that You didn't that notice before. that the so, painting was flipped? Yeah. Am I flipped? No. My hand You're not be, flipped, but the other thing's flipped. Yeah. No, well, I, I do so play left-handed, though, sometimes, so don't, don't let it surprise you. I remember I did one time Jasmine had a 
bizarre fancy where she's like, man, I my right hand ever gets hurt. Uh-huh. I need to practice with my left. So she like did a whole painting left handed. Uh huh. I did. And I it looked it looked perfect, but it, it was still a weird thing to do. I did it. Yes. I would. I prefer my right hand though. Yeah. Jasmine Jasmine can switch off a little a, a little bit, but yeah. I, she's still dominantly right handed. I can't write with either. <laughs> no kidding. Effectively. Jasmine's one of those people that have notes. Like if she writes a note from six months ago, she can't read what it is no. like later because she doesn't recognize what it says yeah. it's a different part of your brain your handwriting looks pretty much like mine doesn't it we just Who? we just kind of oh, write right? but you write big block lo- letters right I was taught a method of writing called Danilian which I believe was only popular it, for is weird. one yeah. year and the year I went to school or whatever, but I, it, it works. So I can it read was it. supposed to have been the, the next cursive. So I learned how to write Danilian yeah. and it, <laughs> nobody else did. And I never learned how to write properly. Paging uh, Dr. Jasmine. What? April oh, said. Yeah, I know. Right. Um, it's true. Ah, for the, the scripts yeah prescriptions. Sheesh. yeah some of those i don't see why they're not getting people killed constantly by not being able to read <laughs> what medication they're supposed oh, to oh kaza kazamaka actually was a, a i've heard about this uh sort of thing um she says i can paint and draw with both but only write with my left hand the nuns tried to ah. tie my hand behind my back in mm-hmm. convent school ah. people, there used to be a lot of pressure to be left right-handed at school in general even when i was in school i don't know why millie says technically like zoom jasmine and the painting are opposite but it's like we're in front of her watching her paint ah. oh that's true but it's not though i i, I could see what they're saying yeah now. but i mean for example if i were to spell something out it would be backwards right yeah hold up something and let's see what it looks like like my strangeling logo is it yeah. backwards um let me see is the pin backwards Yes. Okay. See, so I don't want the painting to be. I, <laughs> no, I put a lot of thought into okay. the angles and things. So well, it, putting a, a flipping a painting backwards is not a not a okay in general. But we'll, we'll like flip, if it was printed we'll backwards, I'd back. be like, oh my god, it's backwards. You know, we'll flip it back. Oh, okay. Thank you, guys. Or we'll figure it out. Or if I grab, we'll figure we'll fig- we'll figure it out if we have to crank the camera the other way somehow. We'll we'll figure it out. It's, I don't know how to fix it. I just oh okay. Wanted. No, we don't want to do it in right. the street. We'll just do it next time. Mm-hmm. Just know it probably looks even better <laughs> when it's not the image. Yeah. Hey! There we go. You just like making kitty, don't you? I do. <laughs> that is um, Rio, who's only appeared on this broadcast, I think, twice. Twice, maybe, yeah. Because she she hates the limelight, even though she's probably she's the most beautiful. um she's probably the prettiest of our cats yeah. in a an aesthetic sort of way, yeah. not in a goofy gamma or a kitten sort of way. <laughs> yeah, gamma just looks like a big cross-eyed black baby black bear. Yeah. Where's the bear from the drizzly ads? The drizzly ad? Uh huh. It has a little bear. I think of Gamera just being like this drunk bear that shows up all cross eyed. Oh, Kazumaka, who's watches pretty regularly, uh, think, uh, thinks I've only seen Rio on the screen once. Oh, wow. Could I thought be. it was twice, but yeah. I don't know. Might have missed one day, too. I don't know. Maybe she got so, out when I wasn't uh, here. <laughs> how are the British people holding up? You, you guys still awake? You guys just kind of looking at the screen? I bet they're asleep. So with sleepy eyes, because they're sleeping. I can't stay up very late, particularly <laughs> watching like a screen really close. I think mm-hmm. I could do it on the TV. Yeah. Um, and you said that Roku has a Twitch. Yeah. Yeah. A Twitch app. You know, I might, I might um do that, like watch some uh, streams. Yeah, you could watch some on Roku. Night, night, Matt, Jasmine, and Brandon. Oh, oh. Lila's saying night, night. I was gonna say that's some British people going to sleep. Night, night, guys still awake i don't sleep we'll i back. know you don't ricky because i will be talking to you what would be basically like 3 a.m and you like on facebook or something and you respond back i'm like why and why isn't in, ricky asleep she's in france it could be any time of day and she's still up 
I think a lot of the people that she chats with are American folk, yeah. and it's kind of crazy. I'm watching in diamond painting from London. Ooh, ooh. Uh, I miss London. I miss London. Um, how's, so much. How is London uh, lately, Mandy? Yeah, I haven't been there. Uh, Jeanette took a nap to prepare. Aww. Has Jasmine ever done L Leda and the Swan? I have, but not for a while. I did Leda and the Swan, I did painting in 2002, I think that was Leda and the Swan. Almost 20 years ago, some people might remember it, <laughs> since we did have, just have our 23rd anniversary. It's actually pretty far into having my website. Um, I don't think it's, it's not on, currently on my website, but I should paint later in this one again. That's always a good painting. Always got to figure out how tasteful you want to make it and how much actual bird diddling's in there, you know? I'm so sorry. we have a, oh. 137 people okay. in the room, but not yeah. everyone's joined the raffle. Oh, well, maybe not everybody's trying it. Yeah. yeah. Maybe not. People are like, you know, I got Should I join stuff. it again? <laughs> if I win the original, Jasmine... Oh um, can I choose the original? Uh, yeah. It has to be one you already own. Oh, uh, or maybe I can... Can I exchange it for cash? No. Um, yes, uh, you can. I've seen Zeus in Europa. Oh, that's a be beautiful Zeus in Europa. The, the cow. Yeah, that's, I like that The cow one. was great. Cute, that's a cute painting. I, that's always one of my favorite ones. I like seeing galleries, yeah. too. Whenever there's a Zeus in Europa, it's like, oh, oh I want to see the beautiful cow. Well, th those are strange situations where there's a, a, god has to a romantic <laughs> element where a god decides to be an animal. Like it's going to trick a lady. It's like, oh, look. I'm going to trick they're... a milkmaid by being the cow. Exactly. Yeah. And then suddenly, haha, I'm Zeus. And that, it's like, that's creepy. They couldn't creepy. come as like a half god, good looking muscle guy. <laughs> you have to come as like a, a swan, you know? I oh, know, I guess dude. it's been really hot in London. Oh, has it been? Um, for the last two weeks. But now it's cooling down. I haven't down. even been looking at weather in other places. I'm ashamed of myself. What about um, Theseus and the Minotaur or Perseus and Andromeda? Ah, well, you know, I do have um, a piece planned with Ariadne and um, the Labyrinth, so. Uh -huh. I don't know, maybe so. I'm trying to think. I have another mythology piece that I was doing for um, the Corey Helford show. Well, stay tuned because I'll definitely be keeping y'all updated as we do Twitch. And uh, I'll be sure to like write down somewhere when I'm working on the, the silent Twitches throughout the week about like what the painting's called. And we're going to set up some sort of thing eventually where like patrons can pre-order canvases through the website and stuff like that too. So you don't have to like send us an email and all that. So those those will be things we're going to be implementing too with these different live stream stuff. Yes, yeah, Jasmine does because those will be additional Patreon nice medusas. Too. Yeah, I painted a lot of. I love medusas. I like the story too. Oh, Medea is one I'm wanting to paint. Cool. I painted one Medea back in 2001. Remember, she has a little poison vial. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's not on the website or anything, is it? No. No, that one's not on the website. But um, I'll paint a new one, though. And maybe that will be on the website. Sunshine. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I don't even think it really is sunshine. Where did she go? Uh, I think she's in her little... In the little hole? Yeah, I'll go check. Okay. That's really cute. I'm definitely going to make sure she has blue eyes. Oh, she's not in there. You want to show her little hole that she's somewhere below there? I don't. Um, it's probably covered with cat hair, and I don't. I don't want it to land on my wet painting or my palette. So. Yeah, cat fur. Remember, we got rid of the carpet, though. Yeah. Oh God. I hate. I hate carpet. How many kitties do you have, Raven? Two. Or is it? Is the cat fur like crazy? What do you mean? The cat fur everywhere. Dude, they're not even. They don't even really go in my room very much, and it's all over the place. Oh. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. It's just insane. Who is Medea, Jasmine? What is her story? Medea murdered her children. Yeah. <laughs> she was, let's see, she, I, I'm probably going to tell it wrong. I'll, I'll research it better before I paint her again, but she was, she was married to Jason, right? Argonauts Jason? I think so. Yeah. 
and she um, is pissed off at him because he has an affair, right, or something. Uh, he's Jason. Oh, he's Jason, yeah. So she's pissed off at him. <laughs> and to get back at him, she murders her, their children together. It, like, murders them. Because it's like, hey, I, I, it, it, like, ignoring the fact that she's their mom, basically, sort of. But, and then murdering them because, to get back at the dad. So, you know, it's the same stuff that people get in trouble for these days. But You know, that's that's not that's how untrue. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, even a Doctor Who theme painting. That would be most amazing. I would that works with licensing i don't know about doctor who because it's bbc licensing it's bbc i assume I they probably know. license but they're they're a public company you know i have no idea I, I don't know i'm not a citizen but i do pay my bbc television license every year or whatever the heck it is in England, we have so, to in yeah. order to watch it <laughs> but um for something i i don't know i i still don't quite understand <laughs> I it don't, i don't they know they could lie to us do. and probably yeah, like, yeah, yeah that's gonna be a, yeah. a lot there etc not as much as they do in America, but... When I went out to walk my dog, my cat McCormick sat on my bed next to my phone and listened to Jasmine and Matt. Aww. Aww. Good kitty. A good kitty kitty. And good doggy. Aww. Good doggy. BBC would have to give permission, I think, as they yeah. own it. Well, a absolutely. Yeah, but what yeah. I'm saying is I don't know what a BBC license is I don't know how licensing like. works with them. Yeah, because No idea. I know that I can go to the store and buy Doctor uh, Who things. A so they yeah, of course. They, they have somebody that handles their licensing. I'd go direct to Mr. Moffat. Shove the BBC. Yeah. Insert's angry face. Yeah. 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 I like you. That's Kazumaka. Yeah. Hardcore. Welsh woman. Hardcore Welsh women. <laughs> That's who we cater to on that this is, channel. That is my target demographic, and you know it. Red dragons and what else was it? I do paint a lot of red dragons. Uh, oh, daffodils. Red dragons and daffodils. Red dragons and daffodils. Yeah, I should paint them together. I'm sure Into de Papillon has the um, daffodils in it. Have I been to Wales? You have not been to Wales, I don't think. Oh. I don't think so. You've been quite close. You've been across from Cardiff. I yeah, think. I want to go really to Wales. Bay, but you've been to Cornwall, of course. Yeah. Yes, and then she says something in Cthulhu language and says, Wales forever. <laughs> they do talk Cthulhu language. They though, do. Don't I think they? they speak Cthulhu. I think that's what they call in, it, in Cthulhu Wales. language. It's not how they spell it, though. I think you. I think you guys like what we do in the shadows. Have you seen the original film? Yes. 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 That yes. Uh, we um we made a point to watch the original film before the TV series. Just uh, in, I don't know why. Um, just in case it would. Well, I didn't know um, how much of it. Like, well, I didn't realize that the characters actually appear. Yeah. Yeah. In one of the yeah, episodes, yeah, and that was really cool. Yeah. And Jasmine and I are both big Matt Berry fans. Yes. Yes. And. I love his character. He's great. I love him and Nadia. They're just great. Yeah, particularly yeah. the episode where he gets the toothpick and he's in disguise. Yes. Oh, my God. When he's yeah. working at the bar. Very brilliant. Holy cow. Yeah. Good show. Say it as you see it. Come re ambeth Aha. Uh -huh. That's some... Um... So that means whales forever. Yes. C-M-W... C-Y-M-R-U... Am... Yeah, I am this. I've got a relative um, on my Griffith side of my family who spells their Griffith still the um, Welsh way, and it's like G R Y F F Y U D, I think. Y D D. Y D D. Yeah. Well, she um, and she's not absolutely mad or anything. No. No. <laughs> not not, not her. Not her. No. No. If you're watching Aunt Pat, I love you. Yes. But she's mad. I have two ant pads. I don't know which one we're talking about. Oh, wait. Yeah, we do. <laughs> you have two ant pads? Yeah. One's on my other side of the family. You're oh, yes, sure yes, yes, yes. Sure. Yes, that's, okay. that's yeah. cousin, though. There's that great aunt. She's my aunt pad. I can't keep she's track of your wacky cousins. She's my she's my grandmother's sister. Jasmine's got more. She's like a Care Bear with all her cousins. I don't even know cousins. how many stepsisters I have. <laughs> yeah. I, got, I got a lot of family. Matt Berry, Garth Marenghi's Dark Place, yes. Masterpiece Comedy. Yes. We have the DVD. Yes. Those are great. Mara Kay says, what inspired Jasmine to begin the Faces of Fairies series as she has finished with the series? Well, it's not necessarily. 
necessarily that I'm finished. I mean, the reason I'm finished with the series is because I, I kind I, I, we stopped making prints that were six by six. <laughs> I think is why, and, and they were six by six. There were painting, so there were um, uh, practical and logistic kind of reasons, practical reasons to to um, stop. Yeah, that, and that I process. well also too. Um, I started doing faces of Perry because I wanted. It, I I had I painted a lot. I think um, that was the first art show I did, like outdoor art shows in Celebration, Florida, and I wanted to have. They required that all we had was original paintings, no prints, I think, the first time. So I was like, well, shoot, I need to do a whole bunch of original paintings. So I, I just made some small ones so I, I would have things that were cheap if people didn't have a lot of money or whatever. Yeah. So um, that's why I did. And I was like, oh, these are fun. It's also kind of a fun way I could do a small painting without committing to spending weeks or months on something if I decide I don't like it halfway through or whatever. And it was a way I could experiment with different colors and face types and try out different things. And it's an awesome series. I also make awesome great series. canvas cuties. They make wonderful canvas cuties. And, and then since then, I've started doing larger pieces. And when I want to do a small study, I mostly do mini paintings or tiny treasures. Because they're a lot smaller. There's like a tiny treasure is really like one fourth as big as like a, a face is a fairy. So it's like a lot littler and they take less time. And I can still get the sort of color rough idea when I'm planning a bigger piece. And it makes a nice little product that people can hang up later, too. That's basically why. That's why. That's why, Maddie. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> that was the real. Okay. <laughs> My wedding ring I just bought is made from Clogau Rare Welsh Gold. Ooh. From the Snowdonia Mountain Range. It's wow. called... Ambeth ring. Oh. Huh. Interesting. That sounds lovely. Dang, everything you say, Kazumaka, sounds like it's from a like a, she a so high much. fantasy yeah. book. <laughs> it does actually. It's like very It's like it's forged earth. by the dwarves themselves. <laughs> yeah. In the fires of Snowdonia. <laughs> Tilda Swinton was in the series, one of the awesome yes. Vampire Council. Yes, I love. Yes, she was. Love and she, some Tilda because um, if yeah. you noticed in that episode, all those people p played vampires in other, other films. Other films. Tilda yes. Swinton being um, the uh, what's the only lovers left alive? The only lovers left alive, and that, that was movie. a fantastic film. Yeah. That was a really good That's vampire film. Great movie. That starred uh, Loki. Yeah, Loki, Loki was and in it. Tilda Swinton. Yep. As Loki. I'm not Welsh, by the way. English by birth, but Welsh by heart. Oh. <laughs> I lived here over 20 years, longer than I ever lived in England. What? They're so far away from each other. It's <laughs> like nothing like from Kansas moving from, from Kansas Missouri. to Missouri yeah. or anything like that. Well, they are different countries and have different languages, so yeah. It it's true. Different. One speaks Cthulhu and the other one speaks... Uh, uh, Fancy American. I was going to say, it, it, you know, it speaks like uh, Jeeves and Wooster. Ah, yeah. One's Jeeves and Wooster, the other one's Cthulhu. <laughs> P.G. Lovecraft. Dakota Fanning. <laughs> yes. She was a vampire oh, yeah, in the that. Twilight movie that we all love so much. She's the one who had, let's see, uh, she looked at people and she's like, pain or whatever. What'd she say? What Is, wasn't that about? like her power in the Twilight oh, thing? Oh, God, honey. I don't she just know. like stared at people and said pain and her isn't eyes were really red. Isn't that what everybody did? movie because that's kind of what i got out of well it. i i, I no, thought that's sorry. what the director was saying. Just sorry look at guys people say pain. sorry forgive no. me if no I'm... i know i have a lot of twilight fans here this is just me being a dick sorry yes after yeah. uh after <laughs> Anne rice sorry. i was kind of i thought vampires were complete with with the Anne rice stuff i don't think so how about um uh, what's his face that um a uh, swedish author wrote the let the white right one in i didn't read it though oh it's a so good book. i don't know Oh, he's a good it, it's, author. it's an interesting take. I'd say I uh, he, he only wrote lovers the best left alive book about is, zombies. Is, is I think I've read. Cool too, but I dig it. He's written one of the only books about zombies that is any good. Hmm. That I I feel. <laughs> let me in. That yeah, but yeah, um, that's what I mean. Let the let right one in was let the me, the right one in was the was the European Swedish, one. Yeah, the the European movie title of it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, because it's supposed to be the, like the Morrissey quote, right? Or, no? Or, wait. Probably. Yeah, probably. I mean, it's yeah. got to be Morrissey. Yeah, they talk about Morrissey in that book, it seems like. Actually, they talk about 
What's the other book he wrote? Little Star. That is good. I like that one. I wish I would have read it when I was a teenager. Uh, somebody said loved... Team Edward. Yeah. <laughs> What's it's the Team other? Batman I, I'm the other now. one. Huh? He's going to be Batman. Oh, he's going to be Batman. Yeah, Pattinson. Okay, good for him. He That's what I'm around, saying. Man. Dig your way out. Yeah. No, he can he's, actually, he's he actually can things. turn into a Batman. He was in uh, Maps of the Stars. I really liked that. And so he can he can be a good actor. So Katie wants to go to Forks and do the Twilight tour. Cool. I'd like Jedward. To, I'd go there just to look at their pretty trees. Team Jedward. Jedward. The trailer came out and looked really good. Says Rage Pixie. Oh, I'll I'll check it out. I. What trailer for which one? The trailer for the new Batman. Was oh, Robert I haven't seen it. It seems like there's a new Batman every few years. So I don't they know. They should combine yeah. and have a Batman like. That horrible Doctor Who movie that had like all of the doctors in it. Oh, the really the, old one. The million doctors. Yeah. Yeah, that was that was pretty <laughs> cool. It's 9 a.m. somewhere, that one. Yeah. Kidding, but apparently Jedward are reuniting. We are doomed. I didn't know that. Oh. Um, and that Nintendo guy says it's not good, it's amazing. Oh. Cool. Well, I'll have to check that. Have you seen the trailer, no. Brandon, for the oh, new Batman? Sorry. Yeah. I'm not used Is to it good? There being good? More than one person. You like it? House. I'd probably like it too. The Flash movie will have two Batmans, one being Keaton. Flash Gordon? I don't think that's confirmed yet. Oh, Katie, that's not been confirmed yet. She might be in on it. Who knows? She's probably writing it. She's probably, yeah. One day... Yeah, there's a lot of stuff that might be confirmed on Tuesday, but from what I heard, I don't think it's yet. I don't know. I was happy with the Christian Bale Batman. I like that series, actually, quite a bit. He always did kind of remind me of Patrick Bateman. Yeah. <laughs> Who, Batman? Yeah. Oh, Batman himself. I thought you meant Christian Bale. I was like, yeah, a little bit. Remember, I've got that um, copy of American Psycho, and it says Batman instead of Bateman. <laughs> On one page. Yeah, it did, did say paperback. Batman. Uh-huh, I yeah, showed Yeah, and that you. was confusing. It's an old paperback, are, too. How's your speed? How are you looking? Here. Does it look good? Yeah. Okay, I'm just... Well, I've got a different mug. This is same iced tea. It's not beer. It's in a house. I'm being house mug. a bit. DC I think about my house event was mug. Whenever I yesterday, break one, so a bunch of newsers released. Now let's go back to another one. So, oh, okay. You know, I'm not putting it really close to the edge or anything. Well. Okay. I don't know. What's happening? Uh, Is it okay? I was slowing down and he oh. was... Brandon wanted to look at it. Okay. They were being all SJW all over Twitter, too. SJW. SJW. I like guessing what things mean, not correcting myself. I have no idea. Sally, Jesse, Waffel. I was going to say, uh, yes. no. um, uh, Sensory Jehovah's Witness. Oh, sensory or sensual? I was not going to say sensual. Oh, okay. Uh, um, I, don't, I, don't, I don't want to go to that, okay. um, um, that, that website. I don't know. S -J Sarah Jane Adventure? Oh, wait, no. That's Social justice warrior. Oh. 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 Okay. Oh. oh. Okay. Okay. I see. See, I, I don't. Politics isn't my first thought on this sort of podcast. Gotcha. There are poli podcasts that are for politics, believe it or yeah. not. Yeah. But yeah. <laughs> Some people call me Nuxukau, though, Jasmine. Um, do it they? means the white warrior. Uh, who calls you that, baby? Who calls me Nuxukau? Yes. Uh, it <laughs> happened in 1989. I was going to say, I bet. Yeah. But we keep politics away from Twitch. Yes, we do. <laughs> and the sad thing is, the scary thing is everything's politicized. So it's like... <laughs> everything's uh... politics. So. I'm taking some pains gray. And starting to outline parts of her eyes a bit more. Because <laughs> it's going to be brighter blue, but I'm still Take working on the underpainting. Blob Help knew the reference. What's that, baby? Blob oh. Help knew the reference. Oh, okay. that makes me happy. <laughs> I just, I just wanted one person to get it. Is Kickboxer on your list of movies all young men should watch? Actually, no. Okay. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna subject uh, Brandon to, <laughs> to Kickboxer. Okay. Good. And to a lesser extent, the Van Dams. <laughs> 
I'm looking forward to the Kingsman three coming out in September. I haven't seen, um, I haven't seen one or two. Oh. I'd, I'd probably like them. I haven't the, seen them. I have to get past thinking that the main guy in the first one kind of just looks like a punk ass. Maybe like, he plays a punk ass and it's good acting. I th- yeah, and he maybe he learns his lesson or I something. I haven't seen any of those. You didn't like the second? Well, I'll, I'll I'll give it a chance, but I'm who's waiting on the, the Witcher the season two coming like out. I think a lot of people are. Which one? Witcher two. Oh. The, 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 the Witcher season two. Ah. Time to watch the Radioactive Man movie. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> the goggles they do nothing. They do nothing. Have you seen that one yet? The goggles they do yeah. nothing. Yeah, I love that one. Uh, it's uh, radioactive. Oh, uh, McBain. Uh, McBain. McBain. Yeah, that's a. Those are good. You're watching the, the, when the Simpsons. I feel was at its best. Yeah. I like Van Dam. Mm-hmm. And I don't. I'm not sorry about it. <laughs> You're an unapologetic, <laughs> ACVD fan. Blob help knows the reference. My eyes, the goggles, they do nothing. Mm-hmm. I'm waiting for Stranger Things season four. I think, yeah, that's half of what my Facebook talks about. I haven't seen any of those. I haven't. No, had it's got anybody... Winona Ryder in it. I, oh, great. I like Winona Ryder. I haven't. I haven't had anybody tell me I would like Stranger Things. Like anybody. Uh, I think it. that you you have you don't have, you have a it? lot of love for '80s nostalgia, except for music. Really. Huh. Well, okay. I, well uh, no, no, actually, that's not true. I, pretty, I, yeah, I have very I, specific music. I, I think like that you kind of... For, well, see, 80s alternative first wave sort of stuff. I love that. But, like, not like Whitney Houston, like, hair bands or anything. I like the movie Hard Target <laughs> with Van Damme. I like the hair, too. He had the best hair. What did his hair look like? Oh, it was a, a super awful mullet. It was oh. fantastic. It was lovingly crafted for mm-hmm. for Van Damme specifically. Okay, that'd be funnier if it was crafted for somebody else. Kazumaka said the '80s traumatized me. Yeah, me too. Well, as it as it did us all. <laughs> but we we take those we take that with us as we go along. And use it to remember. on this wacky journey. Yeah. Well, all, lol, the greasy mullet. I th- I still think the hands down winner of the. Uh, the best mullet sort of thing of all time is Michael Bolton. Who is on Patreon now. He is on Patreon yeah. now. Um, Michael Bolton is on Patreon Bloodsport's now. fantastic, so, Blob. I, I don't know I've what he seen puts on Patreon, but over 50 pointed times out he was on Patreon. Easily. I've got issues with Bloodsport. I can even do the dim mark technique. Really? Bottom one. Yep. Wow, well, my honey. You've seen me do the dim mock technique. I used to do it at Rainforest Cafe. But I used to do the three inch punch at Rainforest Cafe yeah. too. Yeah, you killed a lot of people there. I killed a lot of people at killed Rainforest Cafe. Killed a lot of people! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Rick rolled. Oh, yeah. He, um, was he on Patreon? Rick he might be. Really? All I remember in the alive? 80s was yeah. the police brutality and the hairspray. But when I, I was like in single digits growing up in the. 80s, so I was too young for it, really. Mm. Me too. That's all you remember. Wow. I don't remember Not, it very much. I don't think that's the widest view of the 80s, but it's it's your view, so I, well, I'm not gonna argue. You gotta remember, Matt. If, if like I was I was in single digits in the 80s, also for the most part. Yeah, yeah. except for the very last year. Yeah, and then had... even then, only for a couple months. So right. yeah, I was yeah zero through nine in the 80s. Yeah, so. I had my um. My teenage, more teenage formative years, yeah, late eighties, early nineties. Yeah, older. Yeah. So, but I watched a heck of a lot of TV and as many movies as I could get my eyes on in Aww. the eighties. So, I loved the theater back then too. Yeah. Like, take <laughs> me to a movie. Mean. What do you want to do? Go to the movies. What do you want to do? Go to the movies. Dollar movies. And I then the dollar movies I came, and movies. I just yeah. sat there all day. I like going to movies. Hey, movie theaters opening now again. I haven't been to them. I other haven't than either. I'm, I'm going to see yeah. how that that rolls out. I, AMC, I think, has done it for the most part. Yeah, AMC in Florida at least is. I think yeah. all of them are. 
Yeah, and I know that there's a, a couple. Th- it, there's a theater that Katie had went to that she said they did a really awesome job in Kansas City. Oh, really? Yeah, she was saying that on her Facebook. She's probably room. still in the room. Okay, cool. But yeah, I I miss the I miss the movies. I like seeing. It's I like watching TV and. Things. Do, let's go to movies. Yeah, but it's not the same thing. No. Yeah, you can just kind of sit close to the TV. It's not the same. Watching it on your phone is not the same thing either. My mom asked me what movies were Angelina Jolie plays a hacker, and me hackers. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's true. Yeah. Oh my gosh, and their hacking was so. Uh, have you seen Hackers? I have not. Uh, Brandon. No. I don't think so. But he, he, no, this was older this than. This is Angelina Jolie, like when she's it, a teenager. They're, it's like they're, ha- yeah. this is before, it's like when hackers first started becoming more reg, uh, like I'm a hacker, people yeah. would say that. It, their hacking is so. It's like watching the elementary. net or something. <laughs> yeah. It's like, it reminds me of that, remember before Dinosaur the Ride? I'm in. Where it like presses three <laughs> buttons. That's what that, yeah, the, the, the movie hackers, hackers remind me of. It's. Um, I want to see Bill and Ted face Mew too. Me, Mew too. Me too. Mew too. It was weird back in December not having possibility of seeing you at Cinemark. Oh, I'm sorry, Aww. Katie. Yeah. Um. I I do like the Cinemark in um in uh Miriam. Miriam, yeah. Yeah. What's that werewolf movie with E.T.'s mom in it? <laughs> I don't know, but it sounds like something you'd ask me. Eddie. Um. <laughs> I'm trying to think. I, I, E.T.'s mom. I think she is in a werewolf movie. <laughs> Wait, isn't movie. E.T. No, the I, little monster? <laughs> isn't, like, the kid? Okay. No, but oh. Blob Help has it in quotes. Now now I can't think of... Um, what is that werewolf movie? <laughs> well, who's E.T.'s mom? E.T.'s mom? Isn't she E.T.'s an mom? The, uh, she has a short blonde hair. How is that E.T.'s mom? Oh, you just say E.T.'s mom. Oh, okay. The howling. <laughs> Sorry, I... Oh, it was the howling. I saw the howling. She had, like, sh- short hair. And there's also a three, the Australian one. Yeah, and for some reason it brought to me, brought to mind um, the short-haired woman that was in Teen Wolf Two. That's a werewolf movie. Yes, it is. (laughs) I've not seen it either, but I know it's a werewolf. And um, that that movie is not that good. But instead of basketball, they have boxing. Teen Wolf Two is just a. That American Werewolf horrible. in Paris is good. American Werewolf in London is the best werewolf movie, uh-huh. in my opinion. So I liked it a lot. It it also helped form my ideas about werewolfiness. How do we get on werewolves anyway? You all were always talking about werewolves, man. Yeah. I'm gonna take you near on India. And oh, you're Jasmine, which people? About which howling werewolves? do you like the best? Uh-huh. Howling? The marsupials? Uh, I said I've seen Howling 3, the marsupials that <laughs> takes place that's, in That's Austin. what Jasmine, that's Jasmine's That's my contribution to werewolf conversation. No, actually, I like a lot of werewolves. Actually, things. Thriller. What's that French uh, film? A, as a small that, film is a fantastic it? werewolf. There's a French film, uh, uh, something, Le Loup, or something, uh, Brotherhood of the Wolf. Mm, dog Soldiers too. Dog Soldiers. Those are some all right. Thirteen mm-hmm. Ghosts is pretty funny, says someone. I haven't Teen seen Wolf that. Two is an uh, an abomination. <laughs> yeah, Fright Night is fantastic. Fright Night is a very good eighties horror film. I I and I, I love. I know they made a David Tennant remake of that, and my art. I still haven't in it. seen it. I haven't seen it either, but my artwork's in the new version, the David Tennant one. And you still haven't seen and it. I still that haven't seen it, and apparently it's even got David Tennant in it. But so. yeah, Fright Night, and I'm, and I think a blob helps talking about the original, um, from the eighties. Ah. Uh. It's pretty fantastic. It's good. Yeah, Thriller is good as just a little movie. Um, besides the, I mean, the dancing and, and music is Heck. is there, but I think it's a uh, the special effects are outstanding. And it also has a combination of zombie and werewolf. Remember Ellie watching Captain EO and saying. That guy is, like, really good at dancing. I mean, yes. seriously, he should be a dancer, talking about Michael Jackson. Yeah. Night, like, yeah, he's... Uh, I'm he's not a big fan of Nightbreed. I need to rewatch it, but I remember seeing... I remember being so pumped about wanting to see the movie Nightbreed. They had this insert in every comic book that I was, I was reading say, about them. they have it in Fangoria also? I'm, I imagine. Yeah. I mean, it's Nightbreed. Yeah. But I mean, it's I Nightbreed. Thought, I've never... 
except I mean, except for the I like Ringo. Uh, I haven't seen Clive Barker's. Which one? I, I I sometimes think his stories aren't done justice on film. I agree. Hellraiser it, to Hellraiser is effectively creepy. It is. I'll give it that, but I don't think that he has. I don't. I think if they a lot of short redid stories some of are those, quite good. His, I actually prefer most of his short stories. That like they could do, they could they could redo it and and um, yeah. Nightbreed needs to be seen in the director's cut. It's so much. Better. Oh, that could be it too. That could be too. It could just be bad editing. Um, that can why do you rub so your finger much. on the paint after applying it to the painting uh, creatively Emma asked I just paint smeared around saves time uh, kind of blends it in softer too so like since I, I use a lot of water you see I'm sticking my hand over here a lot I've got like a, a bottle of water or a cup of water that I'm dipping my brush into so if I have um, if I have drips of water and sometimes the paint isn't very even like it's part of it's more sticky and part of it's runny I'll put it on here I'll smear it around to kind of fit into the shape a bit more so it doesn't run downhill since I'm working at an angle. It's like if you're frosting a cake. Well, actually, you should never do that when you're frosting a cake. You'd like stick your fingers all in it. Don't listen to me. Yeah, actually, in, in most instances, instances, don't listen to Jasmine. Yeah. But when it comes to blending paint, yeah, sure. Yeah, that's, that's, that's a good idea. I would say, uh, I don't know, you have good advice on some things. I've never claimed to have good advice, but I know a lot about things. I like your cooking. Oh, I am good at cooking. I saw a movie as a kid called The Rune Stone. Scared the crap out of me for years. I wouldn't even take my dog for a walk in the dark. It oh terrified me gosh. that much. I'm trying to think. Not been able to find it since the movie that is. You know, that sounds familiar. I think... I think we wanted to be scared. My dad used to show us Q the Feathered Serpent. I'll check that out, Blob Help. Um, that scared the heck out of me, and I loved that movie so much. It's so not really that good, I don't think. But Is Q the Feathered Serpent good? I can't tell. Q the Feathered Ser- Serpent yeah. is ha- has... Uh, has its moments. <laughs> I mean, it's certainly um, riff tracksable. Oh, okay. So people but, would not say, hey, that's a good movie. But it or... has elements of it that I think are, are make for a good story. I liked it very much as a child. Oh, yeah. My Fitbit's telling me I'm just sitting around on my hiney. So what's funny is when you guys do see this picture later, um, it won't be the other way than you see it. It'll be flipped. So the the um, the classical freeze that's going to be in the background here will be on that side and the dark void of foliage will be on this side. Oh, Kit Joe Yuki says, so glad to watch you painting again. Smiley hey, face. thank you. Thank you for coming back to watch me. I had a Should friend named Yuki in week? high school. Had what? I had a friend named Yuki in high school. Yeah. It took about two months before we understood each other, though. Oh, Because yeah. they spoke Was Japanese. From, Jap- from Japan, yeah. Yeah. So we communicated through bizarre ways. It was kind of fun. That's a neat thing about having friends when you're little that are from all over the place. Oh, and it, the most terrifying thing on the planet. There you go, peeps, my weakness, clowns and zombies. Ah. Uh, I'm not afraid of either, really. I am. Maybe zombies. Maybe becoming a zombie. I don't that know. Might be scary, I, I, but I'm not honest, afraid I've of not clowns. interacted with clowns very much in my life. It's never been something that's been thrust upon me, with the exception of Ronald McDonald used to come to our school for some reason. Well... I decided after I saw the newest It mm-hmm. uh, versus the one in the uh, that's is that from the eighties? Gosh, I don't even remember the um, the 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 miniseries. The miniseries one. Yeah. Um, I don't remember. I don't know. But either. I I decided that if I want if I was going to be terrorized and killed, I wanted to be by Pennywise oh. because he goes after you in such interesting ways. Like he <laughs> he uh, really puts like Freddy Krueger to shame in the. <laughs> weird stuff he'll do to kill you and i'm like if i'm going out i want to be ki- killed in a really weird yeah trippy way right. so i would prefer if somebody were gonna murder me it uh. would be pennywise i know that sounds bizarre but you think he'd enjoy it he'd probably like it it's also like how if i die i want to make sure i'm eaten by octopuses and things because they'll actually be hungry sure sure <laughs> that's exactly like that Jasmine. and fuchsia says another greatest shawn of the dead 
I love Shaun of the Dead. The I whole think Cornetto it's, trilogy. Is I very think it's good. not. In it's my, not, my it's opinion actually of, my least favorite of the three. Yeah, I don't uh, think Shaun uh, of the Dead Sean is Peg- is funny enough or scary enough to be. I like both. I I mean I don't consider it's a horror comedy, but it's it needs. I wish it had one that really stood out be, further. Like, yeah. It's not. I don't think it's super funny. I love, but I okay, don't think it's Hot super Fuzz, scary. Hot Fuzz is, I think, a million times funnier. Hot Fuzz is way funnier, and is, and also I think uh, World's End is. Uh, Bob helps us. Hot Fuzz is I, the best. Yes, Hot Fuzz is the best. World's End, I think, is second best, and I think Shaun of the Dead. World's is End my was third good. Play. It was an adventure. Yes, I liked World's mm-hmm. End very much, and I, 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 I liked it. I, I liked seeing how it showed the characters grown up and everything, and I, I don't know, it's good. But um, I liked it better than Shaun of the Dead. But Hot Fuzz is the sort of thing that I can watch over and over and over again. It's uh, got something. April says they think Final Destination style, if something was coming after you, would be interesting. Like, oh, yeah. you're you're ac- basically super accident prone. Yeah. <laughs> you know, if there's a crane up there, the chances are it's going to fall on you. I, think I, have I will that. say with the Final Destination <laughs> thing, one of the best ways it's it's quick. It's usually like quick death. That's true. Like suddenly get slammed like into, you know, it's, it suddenly it's gone in a second. Oh, it's, you know, at least we got to the death topic today. Oh, That's you know fun. it. You know it. This isn't even a deathy painting, and I've got some deathy paintings coming up, so. Turns out he was lost asking directions to a kid's party. Pennywise? Oh, I didn't see I didn't like, see it. Really? Um, I that, miss that, that was sometimes. a lot to go through for just getting lost. I oh, mean, the I killings are hilarious in Hot Fuzz. Yeah, that's just hilarious at the end. What is What it? about Jeepers oh, Creepers? Yeah. Jasmine, what do you think about Jeepers Creepers? I've not seen it, but I remember you watched it. In... I wasn't watching it. I wasn't even home. Okay, it was on the, a television in another room in a house I was working in. And you and said it sounded really gross. It's, it's, I said it sounded like the squishiest movie I've ever heard. <laughs> well, that's back when I, I didn't have a screen at all I could watch like from my studio. So I would hear noise from the other room and it just I'd kind of listen to movies and it was that one and it just was squish because I like somebody eating a pile of pudding or something and just yeah ugh huh. and god used to watch the um, Dragon Ball Z's a lot then Maddie and they'd be in Japanese and oh, I couldn't yeah, understand most fun. of it but then I start oh and just like hitting bricks and foley effects the whole time and, well, and if, then if Japanese you watch, if you listen to something like Dragon Ball Z uh huh from another room, yeah, it doesn't sound like a cartoon. No, That's it just sounds like a that. bunch of guys arguing or in yeah, a, arguing in a That's martial nice. arts film or something. Ten emotes shared. I don't know what that means. I don't know. Who knows? My dad is terrified around ventriloquist puppets. Oh. I love them uh, because of the movie called the... Magic. Oh. I remember that movie. I loved That's it too. That's a common uh, device used in horror films. I think yeah. a lot of people are about. I like by lifeless, dummies. weird little things. I do too. I like a lot of the weird, creepy stories that go along with it too. And shut up, Brandon. Oh. What? <laughs> <laughs> Now I was thinking about my little guys. <laughs> I won't. Oh. oh. Yeah. I won't support I like not... keepers. Keepers creepers. Jeepers creepers. Oh, blob help as just typo. Oh. Because the director had been convicted of horrible things. Ew. Well, okay, there you go. That's probably why his movies sound so gross. I'll tr- I'll try not to ask too many specific questions. I'm super intrigued by the entire process, but I'm a fantasy artist who looks oh. up to Jasmine. Aww, this is a Kicho you. Yuki. Thank Are you. questions about art, business, etc. Okay, absolutely. Ask me anything. Absolutely. Yeah, you can ask me. We anything. don't have a lot of time left. Yeah, I, I will but... be back um I, next Sunday. <laughs> Um, but yeah, you can always ask anything. If I if I don't want to answer it, I just won't, or I'll make a joke and change the subject. But I I wouldn't talk about anything. Sure. Oh, uh, there are also a new Ren and Stimpy. Is there really? Is the it John original John Kays are beyond epic. Um, is John Krakowski doing it? I remember seeing him on Jeopardy. I don't know I, if they're. Oh. Yeah, he also has. A, I guess he's very he's very difficult to work with. I've heard oh. Billy West is not a fan. They, but oh. um, Brandon and I have actually had a couple of discussions. About oh, that. have you? Mm. Ask people in the cartoon. Paul is pretty about funny, this. actually. Yeah. Twinkle, I like Paul. I saw that on an airplane. What is it? Uh, Paul. It's a. Uh, it's got Simon Pegg in it and uh, Seth. Uh, what's his name? Is uh, an alien. Oh. 
Have you seen it, Paul? No, I have not. No, Seth Rogen. Oh, Seth yeah. Rogen. Uh, it's I good, though. Not. Um, But it's got uh, Simon Pegg and the, his uh, portly friend. I forget his name. <laughs> Simon Pegg and his portly friend. Simon Nick Pegg Frost? and his portly friend. Is Nick Frost in it? I don't remember his name. No, like his, his, friend, his friend from from the Cornetto trilogy, like um, from Shaun of the Dead, love. No, yeah, Seth, Nick Seth Rogen's an alien, and okay. he's not, like, he does the I'm just the painter. Oh, is no, it, it wasn't Nick Jonah Frost? Hill. I just saw Jonah Hill in I a movie. Somebody watches us. We watched uh, okay. Wolf of Wall Street. Hey, Maddie, is it Nick Frost? I don't know. Okay. Is it's, it I think it's friend? Nick Cage. Is oh, everyone's his... saying Nick Frost in the room. Is it his friend from the Cornetto trilogy? Yes. I've, I've been saying this, like, and you, you and Brandon just can't hear me or something. Maybe not. Yeah. I can't, I can't do... <laughs> You Three conversations at once. This, it's kind of I've got the chat here, Brandon here. I I'm understand. sorry. But yeah, okay. apparently it's Nick Frost. Yes. Jesus. Oh, okay. well, no. Nick Frost. I told you. Yeah. What? You don't confuse him with Jesus? No, I don't. Okay. okay so, guys, hey, I'm going to pick out a winner, oh. and then we're going <gasps> to spin the wheel. It's going to be spinning wheel time. You guys ready? I wish I had a real wheel that I could Are you guys there. ready that for this? That would have been far too low tech, I guess. Um, many flashing colors. It's technically has two minutes left. But oh. I'm gonna close the entries now. Okay, enter and I'm gonna pick a winner win first, and then I'm gonna spin enough. the wheel. So pin, win, wear, pin, pick a winner. Spin. Angela Zonas Kitten BZ. Oh, Angie. So Angela. You, slash Bob. Hopefully, she's still in the room. Or possibly think, Bob. Did they share one on this, or are they? I th- I've seen Bob has have his own. Okay. So let's see. And I'll spin the, the wheel. wheel. Oh, or the she'll wheel's get a button. Spin the wheel. Okay, Angela, keep an eye out. Okay, Angela, um, we'll see what you win. We'll see what you win. Let's see. I didn't see it pop up. I don't know, baby. Dude, did you see it pop up? (laughs) Did it say? I didn't see it on mine. Oh, yeah, mine's mine's back. I'm lagging a little bit. You won a Halloween coloring book. Okay, cool. Awesome. So I'm gonna I'll put that in there and. You probably know how this works. Yeah. And if you already have one, you can give it to somebody else. Or color it in again. Type in Halloween coloring book, because... Yay. Does it does it remember who people... Like, is there? does it know how to contact people? I things? think it does. Um, mm-hmm. I think it remembers them just in case. I can... Uh, there's a couple fail-safes. One yeah. is just to watch rewatch the, the session. Oh, yeah, that's true. Um... Well, this just... is getting pretty dry. Let's see. Oops. Let's see. You did not get those ACOs um, cut, did you, babe? Oh, I did not. Okay. Darn it. That's okay. Wait, no, it's, it's not, though. Did we go for another hour? Or is this uh, it's, hour? it's not. It... Yeah, we're, we're, we're done. Oh. Golly. I just need to put this in the room. Oh, okay. Well, gosh, um, everybody, I will be back. Well, we're, we're not quite done. Uh, I mean, we're not I, done. Okay. Well, kind of, though. I'll be here in the meantime, but um, we'll be done, um, and then we will be broadcasting next Sunday, same time. There's which a is message three from Angela. O'clock, Yay. I got it in there. 3 o'clock Eastern time, noon Pacific, 20 o'clock England time, then we'll be back every Sunday, hopefully, after this. And in the meantime, probably Thursday, Friday, or possibly the week after, I'll be starting the Patreon-only streams during the week. Those are just for patrons. Cost $1 if you want to be a patron, so Yay. it's not that expensive. But if you haven't yet, go join my Patreon, and then you'll get the update and the link in to the new channel, and you'll be able to see me up there during the week if you just want to spy on me and look at me paint. <laughs> I think it will have the, both the cameras, but just no sound. No chat room. Just look at Jasmine and watch her paint. And I'll probably write things on a message board occasionally. Okie dokie. Well, it's it's but nice to see you all, all again so much uh, for virtually. Back to join me. Okay, okay I'm gonna. Again. Goodbye, guys. I'm gonna kill the sound and put Bye. up the little funny.